Hold on. I need two more skins. I just forgot. I don't have them right now. All right. Just post everything in uh, semi-formal debates to, to know what the question is. Anime man's actually better than your stock. Anime man. <laughs> <laughs> nah, but unironic. Sunday, please tell me you didn't pay for Nitro. No, I I got it for free. All right, that's good. I won Rock, Paper, Scissors, and I got like a free month for it. <laughs> I would never, like, I would never pay for Nitro. They need to add more perks to it. Yeah. yeah all the they do have like that special one, but that's like ten bucks a month, and that's retarded. Yeah, I'd rather buy like Apple Music or some shit. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, exactly. If hey, if they linked like Spotify Premium with that, I'd you know Ben have it. Oh yeah, I would have had that on a heartbeat. Yeah, it's just that like the benefits aren't worth five bucks. Like yeah, global emotes. It's like I pass emotes. Like the only ones I use, I can type out right now. Yeah. So I just need one last scan, and I'll be ready to go. Just because I know you're going to ask me for evidence for this. So. These are the only things that you use. I just want to make sure that you have all the evidence you need. Yeah, those are the best. Also, of course, you got to use the eyes. I forgot about that one. Oh, yeah, the eyes. Got the spy. <laughs> I usually use a joy cat. Triumph and smiling him. They don't have an otter emote? Alright, time to like go fuck up Apple. They don't have a lot of animal emotes when they should. Oh, and I forgot about this one. Oh yeah, good old cowboy. Mm -hmm. You can't tell me the drilling emoji is the best emoji of all time. Got clown. This one's new. I forgot we had. <laughs> That's facts. Oh yeah, the facts. Do you matter? I forgot about that one too. Oh yeah. yeah. Facts machine. Y'all ready? Why is Mo trying to talking? stand Black Clover? He's like trying to bait me into like soccer reverse and this bitch with fake my milk. <laughs> All right, I told you I saw ready to go. Have, like pass and fake. All right, you guys should post scans in like one channel. So maybe yeah, formal. we'll do it in a semi-formal. No one else type in city semi-formal unless you want to ban. Yeah, I'll ban you. No, I'm just yeah, so we want to heads I win, tells you lose. Right, I'm gonna give you guys both the debating role then. Right, buddy. If you don't mind, give me um, whenever I go to post scans, because I am on a mobile device. It may take me a second to, to go through them all. Because okay. I have, I have like 230 scans on me for this debate. Hey, where are you? There you are. Mm -hmm. um, Tay, I'm also re-nicknaming you back to Tay, so it's easier for people. Yeah. Yeah, Ingrid. Oh, well, who's Tay? That ass. Um, Tay isn't updating on my screen. And someone who's like... I have the debating role. 
Yeah, that's it. All right. Let me go back real quick. Uh, is everyone dead? Oh. No, um, Tay versus Kappa is about to start after Kappa gets back from going to the bathroom. Wait, who's the third judge besides me and Naya again? Sir, sure. uh, Sir, sure. alright. Oh, alright. Alright, I'm ready. Alright, what's right. recording, right? I said, what if it's recording, right? Alright. All right. Um, how do we want to start this? Do you want to go? You can start first. Yeah. Start. Okay. I will outline my debate with all. We're gonna do Prom All Might versus my normal Mangeki Sharingan Sasuke. You without... said I thought it was healthy All Might. Yeah, uh, Prime All Might. Yeah. Oh, okay. Versus who? Versus Mangeki Sharingan Sasuke, who does not have access to his curse mark. No, he got it taken away by um, Sasuke. Itachi. No, Sasuke by Itachi. Yeah. yeah, he took. He, I don't think he took his own curse mark away because he relied on that a lot. <laughs> yeah. All right. Um, I'll outline my premise is that while Sasuke does have either an equal or a slight advantage over AP. The speed and stamina difference is too great. Well, what do you have? Of a all right, what, what do you have? What do you think Sasuke's AP is? AP is? Um, it's, it should be anywhere longer. between. No. Um, no way. It's, it's 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 probably wrong country level. Why would it be country level? You know, he scales to the Biju. You know, who scales to? All, um, all MS Sasuke does not scale to Biju. Anyone that's been near He's... Biju level has one shot him. <laughs> No, he scouts to the Rakage and B, who um are all. He also but he only the room. only time he the only time um he actually took a hit from the Rakage was in Cloak One, right? Because he got Liger bombed and that shattered his Susano. Yeah. Okay. And he's then to take hits and damage him with the Amaterasu. But that's so. that's Cloak One. Okay, he's one and Cloak Two are completely okay. different. No, he's not. I got scanned right here. Give me one second to pull it up. He also fought Beast and was able to cut off one of his tails and damage him. Yeah, yeah. but we know that Beast tails are easily cut dead. off by everything. Yeah, Beast tails just, aren't they, uh, they are defeat. Yeah, they are because they're still multi-continental regardless. And then he also uh, kills the Datara, who's multi-continental as well. Yeah, the Datara is also not multi-continental. But let's not yeah. shotgun points. Let's not shotgun points. I'm just giving that. you multiple other sheets. No, but you're you're shotgunning. Let's not do that, please. It's a dishonest debate tactic, especially when I said I need I needed time to post scans. Yeah, man. Where is he? At? All right, I think I found the first one. Here, is this one. At? Hold on, if I post a scan, it's the wrong one. Let me delete it. All right, so that's he. That's uh, Lightning Cloak One B, um, Raikage, giving him a little Liger Bomb treatment. But that's not the one I wanted to do. Hold on. Yeah, these are very tiny scans. You want to have a Yeah, these are very tiny scans. Discord won't load on my laptop. No. Okay, here's the difference right here. We can see here. Um, He's because right here he chose his Mangeki Sharingan, and then the Raikage goes from Cloak One to Cloak Two, and then Karin says, um, "Let me get the next scan posted up." Let 
Right. We've also seen um the Rakage um like do a lariat with B and he was able to cut off Kisame's head just with a regular lariat and um Kisame scales to B. Yeah, so like lightning to Rakage here, it's what's on B Judama lo- a B Ju level, not Lightning Cloak one. We we we've seen regular Rakage do a lariat against B who's multi to and do a lariat against Kisame who's also multi and just regular lightning cloak. So you think a uh, severely weakened Kisame is um, multi-continental? I mean, he wasn't severely weakened. If anything, B was more. Can you show that? Show what the scan is yeah. chopping his head off. Yeah. Let me see. Can I find it? If anybody has it. Because if I remember that. correctly, that was after the fight with B, right? B and him. Yeah, he the wouldn't ball. be any weaker. The only person that would be weaker is B. Because no, he was doing that. Was, was drained of his chakra as well. Even before that fight, he was drained. He used Samehada to drain some of these chakra to get some of his chakra. Yeah, out. so if anything, he would actually be amped because actually he drained a lot of bees' chakra. He's not, he's, he wasn't amped. Actually, in the water bubble, he constantly drains the chakra and reverts him back to normal form. So actually, he would be amped. He would be even stronger than what he was at the beginning. Yeah, can you prove that he is amping himself and not just draining chakra? Like you'd have to be well, able to demonstrate that he can, chakra, you'd have, you, you, yeah, you'd he have to be able to demonstrate chakra. that he can overcharge himself with chakra. He absorbs the chakra into himself, so I don't know why. But, I, but, but again, doing. you'd have to demonstrate that he can overcharge himself with chakra, not just stockpile it, right? He has to be able to overcharge himself and contain more chakra than normal, which I'm pretty sure of when I read all this, he was unable. You are, that's not demonstrable. And plus, the fact that he himself has the same chakra level as an entire Biju, him just taking a portion of the Eight Tails chakra would not be enough to f- give himself all the chakra he needed to get back to full. Okay, I'm back. Hold up. Damn, I can do for me, obviously. But we're going to move to these points one at a time. Um, so right now we're just we're talking about um, the Rakage, the clear difference between Cloak 1 and Cloak 2 Rakage. And Cloak 1 not being... Cloak um, 2 is level. Here, Cloak 2 being... So, but it's clearly stated here that there's a big difference between them because Cloak 1 wasn't BG level and then Cloak 2 is BG level. That's a very big clear... That's a very big difference. Why? My computer, I can so slowly. And Sasuke is out of breath um, after using the Susano one time to survive the Liger Bomb. Hello? I don't know why I keep the PF on you. Well, um, they see in semi formal, you know. All right, hold on. Let's read through them. I'm pretty sure that ended up not even being. Um... That ended up not being um, Kisame anyway. Kisame hid away in the uh, Samehada. That was Kisame. He still got cut in half. I don't know what you mean. It's Kisame. Kisame hid away in the Samehada when that happened. Well, I mean, his head got cut in half so he could do that. So he still got, you know, they still have to be like around his AP. I mean, his, their AP will have to be around his durability to do that. He also scales yeah. the data up. And, um, you know, all the cops are stated to just be as strong as the Jin Cherokee, you know, because they have to take them down. Yeah, but it takes two man teams to fight one Jin Cherokee. Not in and even that's we've seen, we've seen Kisame solo for it. 
but it's still in teams of two, so that would be contradictory to them individually being as strong as Jin Cherokee when they're required to run as teams of two. And Kisame is way stronger than Daedra is. And I yeah. have scans of Daedra. Give me one second, since it don't jump from point to point because I can't upload them as fast as I'm I can. Not, I'm just telling you, Kisame, they still yeah. damage but, but you're so jump, You are jumping from point to point. You just introduced four points I'm, at once. I'm, I'm, I'm not, not multiple times not to do that. I'm not jumping point to point. I'm telling you why he scales to Kisame regardless of what she's But said. he doesn't scale to Kisame. He definitely but He scales does not. to B and the Rakage, who. Yeah. You know, Data does, definitely does it, and Kisame definitely doesn't. I'm not talking about He got I'm decapitated. About, I'm talking about um, I'm talking about um, Sasuke. He fought these two people. You know, relatively. Yeah. They would um, well, Sasuke, Sasuke completely does. hard counters Data, and Data didn't even use the strongest attack versus um, Sasuke. He in the first Oh, hold on. The scan before that one. One second. They all look like one big scan on my phone screen. Is this proving? Um, he did not use a strongest attack against Sasuke. Right here. Yeah, see? What is this proving? His, uh, his, his C3, his number 18 C3 is the strongest attack. Which he did not use against Sasuke, so it's false. Wait, and even what is still, C three, his C three number eighteen. His self destruct bomb is way more powerful than this. Damn. But it, it clearly, it's clearly not because yeah, it says from all the things I can make. Because my the, special the, the, C number eighteen has my highest level chakra C three put into it. But the, 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 the is my greatest artistic achievement. The yeah, scan but the AP for this at best is like. Island level, town level. Then, you know, no, it's town yeah. level. The DC really for this is town, town level, level, and then the DC from his, no, the AP um, for it is town level. No, because he scales to Jim Cherokee, as you know. Yeah, but see, the scaling doesn't know, matter when he know. clearly states this is strong enough to just blow up the town. Yeah, but that's contradicted by his suicide bomb, which had never been brought up to the point in this. Yeah, but his suicide, his, the best thing a suicide bomb did was was kill Mondo. And Mondo is uh, definitely nowhere near Jin Cherokee level. Did, which make a huge ass crater, which DC just scales vastly above that attack. And the, the and the suicide bomb hadn't even been brought up at this point, so he would just say by that point that was his chunk. But no, the suicide he, bomb he, is he, are you he, saying he, that he? Hold on, are you arguing that he came up with a suicide bomb all on his own or instantly? I'm arguing that he didn't reveal it until that um Sasuke fight. Yeah, but he was talking to himself. That point's moot. Because he He's wouldn't self in, in context, he wouldn't self destruct himself and kill himself. That would also be he him. clearly says this is his most powerful attack. No, you, because you if it was, it would have killed Gara, and if he killed Gara, he couldn't get the Jin Cherokee out. So he wouldn't use his strongest attack. But you, again, if they scaled each other, Gara. he wouldn't have killed Gara, like you said. If you so, you just contradicted yourself. No, I didn't. His strongest attack would have killed Gara, but that's why he didn't use his strongest attack, so he could get the Jin Cherokee out. Yeah. If you kill Gara, see, the only thing is, so you're, so you're so you're you're being circular in all your statements, saying all these all guys scale to each other. And then when I ask you, how will they scale to this person? How's that circular? Because you're not giving me any any feats to show otherwise. You know, okay, but they all scale to B, who's multi-continental. You know. Yeah. How does Data scale to B? Data never interacted with B. I'm saying all the Jin Cherokee scale to each other, and Data scales. To Do each they? Other. How? Because they're all How able to damage and combat combat each other. They're all able to damage B. When? With um, Biju bombs. Oh, fuck, I don't have You that. mean when um, when Obito was directly controlling them and amping them? No, so this is after they were... Sharing on amps. No, they wouldn't... In, they wouldn't they, okay, I would admit that they were faster, but their AP wouldn't be any different. What do you mean? Their AP wouldn't be any higher. Not to a quantifiable amount anyways. Yeah, but that's only using Biju Damas. It's never shown also, in any of the um, scenes that any of them use Biju Damas. None of them even transform. There's a statement saying that the Jin, the, the um, Jin Cherokee can just break all things in the world, which would just you know break all the land, which would include the continent. Yeah, but that's statements are if, if you have a statement like that and then it's directly countered by feats, then you can't. Yeah, and use then that they have the, and they, then, then they have the feat of scaling to B, who's multi-continental, so it's consistent. The base B isn't continental. Multi yeah, he would have to be because he would have he to can't fight. Be. Yuki. He would have to fight Yuki in the Chaka Toga War, so they would have to be relative to each other. 
That's not true at all. That's just an internal struggle of whoever has more willpower. No, it's still it's still involved in physical chakra. It. No, it's still involved in physical chakra and their um their ability. So you would have prove to prove relative to them. Would you mind proving all that evidence? Uh, I would have to go find that's a very big claim. No, I chose chakra. I was being a little before. dogmatic for you, but that, that when you pull up a claim like that, you have to provide evidence. Wait, for wait, it. what are you disagreeing with? It is a chakra tug of war, which would be physical. It, but it's more to do with willpower. Unless you're saying yeah, but, base Naruto is uh, small planetary. Well, that was Sage Mode Naruto that fought him, but he had to help with Kushina. And Kushina is small planetary, so that is actually consistent. So it would make, yeah, that is actually consistent. She was there in his mental space, and she right. is small so, planetary, then, and she was still biting the knife. So go ahead and so drop like 50 scans to prove all of what you just said. I'm only saying that it is a chocolate tug of war. What can somebody give me that chapter? I do not know that. Oh, uh, yeah, no, you definitely can't ask for access help. That's an automatic concession. I don't, that's not outside help. I know yes, it is. I know that's an automatic exists. concession. It's definitely not outside help. I know the scan exists, and you know it exists as well. I don't even. Ask, I, I can't believe you're asking me to prove this when you know that it is a chakra tug of war. Yeah, imagine, imagine it. asking someone to prove. A proof imagine asking somebody say. to prove something that's so self-evident just because, like, you don't have any other. Oh, now you're saying it's an axiom. What's this scan for again? Why do I need to prove this when it scales to several people? Scales to Vega, scales to the Akage, scales to B. Yeah, you're you just couch stacking all this stuff together. How is this couch stacking? Those are three people because that are you're comparing people, people like without being able to calc and scales themselves. All three of them. He literally fought all three of them and survived and was able to combat them. Yep. But so Data never used his strongest attack against Sasuke, right? Two, Sasuke, six, Sasuke six, got inside six, six, of Mondo six, six, and then teleported out, right? Because that's exactly what happened. So Data would never even use his quote multi-continental <laughs> attack against Sasuke. If Sasuke would never use anything hammer, close. All his attacks would be that strong because he's able to take out Jin Cherokee oh. with weaker attacks. So then he doesn't. So then he does. So no, Data would never fought any Jin Cherokee besides Gara. Yeah, he's able to take and damage them with weaker attacks. Meaning that Sasuke survived yeah. stronger attacks. I mean, they still would be there. No, strong. the only only attack that Gara was hurt by wasn't was a surprise attack. Which again, that would just further prove that off guard attacks, um, off guard ninja and Naruto are nagged by um, off guard. What are you talking about? Yeah. Off guard ninja for? What the hell are you on about? Uh, because the only reason Gar was hurt was because he was caught off guard by an attack from Datara. Otherwise, he was able to struggle. He was caught off guard. Gar wasn't else. caught off guard. He prepped for that. Yes, he was. He covered the entire village so they wouldn't die because he knew he couldn't deflect it. Um, and look at the scan right below it. What is that? His, his what is so that? the sand from his gourd was f filled with with um the clay, and when he pulled it in to protect himself, Data blew it up inside the ball and hit him inside with a small attack. Okay. So okay. he was caught off guard and not. How's that caught off guard? That's his durability. What are you talking about? That's not his durability. He was caught off guard. He saw the bomb go off. What do you mean? He just couldn't react in time. Which means no, he fast. didn't see it go off. It legit went off. While he was protecting himself in the Can you show me inside the ball? I just showed you it right there. I don't know how that proves he was off guard. That would just mean Data was faster than him. He literally, in that scan, Gar literally reacts to it. He's saying no, he literally has exclamation. Outside, he closes it up to protect himself. And then what right is this Guy to grab a plane that would go that way. If I blew something that close to you, to you the same. Before and after this. I'm going to just keep talking over you. If I blew I something that close, you would have to have the same ascend from your gourd that you used to smash my hand so quickly. Also, that was my last attack, too. So for it to be precisely the right spot for me to detonate it, I had to create that chance. That's the reason I used my specialty, number 18, on the village. Yeah. Yeah, typical Kazakage to use his last bit of strength to protect the village, it would have been so much easier just to let it fall on them. He caught him off guard inside the bubble because he was too busy protecting the village, and then he used the barrier on himself. He was still able to damage and combat him before this. I don't, I'm not sure what this yeah, is proven. Yeah. This just means that Gar... Right, so the means problem is you're arguing all his normal attacks are multi-continental and AP. I'm saying that the attack he used against Sasuke would be, yeah, because he used it. But, but it never hit Sasuke. Sasuke used also Mondo these bombs aren't and then unsummoned himself. The, the these bombs aren't inherently even stronger than each other. The DC is just much faster, so he has much area of effect. Can you prove that? He's not necessarily because, um he, because it clearly states that um he puts different amounts of chakra level in this in each of the bombs. 
the smaller he, he, used the bigger, he used the bigger one to get Sasuke, so I don't know. But there's he never hit Sasuke. Of, Sasuke got inside Amanda and unsigned. I didn't timestamp right? the video because, like, it's through the entire course. Fine. Of the I'll just post it since you just completely ignore the fact. Naruto that in that video. He never hit Sasuke with it. He did. So here, let me pull this. Let me find the skin of Amanda. And even if I were to steal Mandy and say that, um, um, this attack is just higher into multi-continental. That wouldn't like. Yeah, but you can't prove it. All you can do is scale with scales. And, 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 and there's nothing quantifiable. Still, and, the, and then he still scales to the Rock High game and B anyway. And then there's okay. the video of B and Naruto um, training. Provide um, evidence for that then. I've already told you why he fought both of them and was able to damage them. You even dropped the scale. Yeah, you, you said you told me. Prove it. Yeah, I also showed you scans of just regular Rock High game cutting off somebody like Kisan, who was also multi-continental. Naruto scales to both. Yeah, but um, Rakai isn't multi continental until he's in Cloak 2. Which but Kisame he, is, and he's able to damage Kisame. Um, Kisame would only be multi continental when he's full chakra, and it's very it's demonstrated constantly. I've already he's not full explained chakra. to you why he kept absorbing B chakras. Exactly. Chakras. So the fact that he had to keep absorbing it means he wasn't at full chakra, unless you can prove he can overcharge himself. Sorry, I'm back. But he's able to damage him in that stand and just, you know, normal landing cook. Yeah, but so being able to damage someone, you don't need to overcome their entire durability to damage them. Otherwise, you would I just one shot them. Yeah, if you overcome someone's durability, that's a complete one shot. I don't think you understand that. But here's a scan of Sasuke coming outside of Manda after he summoned Manda, got inside of him, and unsummoned him. Right? He killed Manda in the process. He 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 was never hit by. Um, there's a scan loading in the him. Was, like, no, there was he was never hit by Dato's attack. And that scan, it's implied that he would have fucking bodied KCM Naruto, who's also yeah. multi-continental scaling to Karama. Yeah. Then he also able to take an attack from B and just regular lightning. So you're seeing all this stuff and not posting anything. I did post scans, like, you know, them scaling directly to him and Sasuke yeah, scales. So, to so he was able to like, stop a cloak one. Um, he was able to stop a cloak one. Beat, um, beat, beat. Yeah, and Naruto couldn't. Like, be, Naruto would have gotten destroyed, and Naruto is multi continental in KCM four because it scales. No, no, it's not. Not in that sense. He had no. He had no intention of hurting the Rakage. Um, he was trying. To, okay, that means his durability would still be that powerful in the Rakage. No, but, but we know that. Uh, we know that. Um, we know that um, Cloak One Rakage is not continental. But I'm, but I'm showing you scaling to people who are like KCM Naruto. But you're not. But, but you, you you need to demonstrate that KCM Naruto is multi-continental. Well, he scales just to, be, um, just just because well, he him, won, he, him, just okay, because he he half, well he's relative to half the, of Karama, and then you know there's half Karama, so put together that would be anything. equal to full. You want me to post games of him bodying Karama, like when in that yeah, and the fact video? that you would well, well, the, the fact that you admitted that Naruto needed help from someone who was already small planetary and that could contain the entirety of Karama. Just an your point mm. of Naruto being uh, multi-continental himself. That's a defeater. What's a defeater? I just told you. I, I, I'm not sure what you're yeah. saying. In, interrupting people while they're talking is also a defeater because you don't get to hear their points. I didn't interrupt you at all when you were just speaking. I'm just not understanding what you're saying. But yeah, I'm going to post the um, All Might Calc um, for his... AP, give me just one second. I also posted a video of him scaling to Karama, which would be full Karama. But again, yeah. even uh, if you low you posted, Karama, should, it would be just be, multi um, so The video you posted was, was someone that was able to hold the entirety of Karama. So that just means Naruto didn't do anything. Oh, uh, what? No, Naruto was able to damage him with Rasengan and stuff like that. Here's the calc for um, All Might being Island Plus, which would be somewhat on par with Cloak One. Um, Can you send me the full calc? That is the full count. It is. Can I see like some pixel scale for this or something like that? Um. Oh, Ike, you know what? If that's the case, I need um your calcs for all the things you've been saying. If 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 we're gonna go that route, I need calcs for everything oh, you've up, said so up, far. Hold up. Hold up.
if you're going to sit there and say you need all this, this, that, and the other, this is from the first punch All Might 3 in the series. Or sorry, okay. The, uh, I, I, okay, I agree with that large thing. Why is Prime All Might this much stronger? As I was asking, mainly. Um, and they're just going off the base on feet that he can, that um, his 60 punches, right? Instead mm-hmm. of throwing five, he threw over 300. Mm-hmm. Um, he do scans of that too, because I'm pretty sure I have that. Right, it's a, isn't so what he, he would have been like. He would have got him. He would have ended his punches sixty times faster in sixty more yeah. punches. Well, no, because he, he said he would have thrown. He he would have only needed five in his prime when it took him over three hundred to drop no move. Why does that imply that taken? he's just sixty times stronger? Because instead of having to throw five full punches, he had to throw over three hundred full punches to equal the same AP. There's, that would inherently mean that it like linearly scales. Like that. you're right, it multiplicatively scales, and he would have needed even less punches. Not inherently, but, but even so, I need you to start pulling out all the calcs. So I don't believe any of the tailed beast or multi-continental. The biggest thing we've ever seen is the nine tails blow up, blow up part of an island when he fought Hashirama. So I'm gonna need some calcs for that, buddy. Actually, if if you're going to be uh, debating like this, then I'm going to need you to provide. Oh, I was I didn't care about the calc. I just wanted to know why. Oh no, oh, you are. The fact that you went that route, we're going to go this route. So I need a calc I for multi-continental tail. I didn't see the pixel scaling until I read the calc. And now I so it's fine. Yeah. No, I need I need calcs for the multi-continental um, Biju Biju because um, the best feat I've ever seen from Kurama was he was able um, to uh, amp Kurama with say? Susano sword. If anybody has able to blow up part of an island. If anybody had it so we can cut time, it's just verbatim to say that the BG can just break all things in the world. Pretty cool, like the yeah. Again, but they can't because we have Hashirama's um, yeah, statue, yeah. which exists in the world, and is able to take hundreds of Kurama, Susano, and to be Judama. So they can't. It's demonstrably false. Well, let me find it. So yeah, Sasuke doesn't have that AP at all. But we need to move on from the point because it's already been like 15, 20 minutes. We can bring up speed if you want. Actually, I will bring up speed now. Um, let me see. Where's my All Might stuff? I don't want to pull that scan out. So do you accept that All Might's the number one hero? Um, he's the strongest hero, yeah. Should be. What I'm saying, do you accept that he's the number one hero? Like constantly throughout the series, even in the anime, he's stated to be the number one hero. Yeah, even in this weekend form, I know that was stated. Yeah. Okay. Like um. So let me. Th- this might take a second because these are further down in my scans. Um. Yeah. If somebody has the G Dama cop on here and just post it, because it'll take me a while to find it. Cause it's like really yeah. far. Well, that's not how one v one debate works. No, I know the calc exists. I'm not being dishonest. It doesn't matter. You can't. You, you're not going to get outside help like that. That's just dishonest. It's not outside help. It's not dishonest. See, I know it exists, and you know of it as well. Right. And everybody knows of it. It's not being being dishonest or anything. All right. So here we have um, Todoroki, who is comparable to um, Midoriya at 100. percent Can I? Right. Why is he comparable to him? Is it like shown? Is it like? Yeah, they they rush at each other to attack, and they're able to I meet that, at the is, same is that time. Is that the sports the festival? Yes. Um, what I'm just I'm showing you. Said? Oh, that's a hundred percent. He can't he can't use full calling yet. He can only use a hundred percent. Oh yeah, but breaks his arms and shit. Yeah, look at his arm. It's complete. It's completely purple from being broken. Look at his other arm on the right. It's it's right. twisted around in circles. If you look at it, it's uh yeah. He he, and then if you look at his his um leg. In the second scan, it says Kirk he shatters his his um left leg by using hundred percent, and Todoroki is able to match this, um in the very center of the um arena. Sorry, I burped. And then Eraserhead, right, is able to completely blitz and tie up. Um, what's this freak's name? I don't care what his name is. Half ice, half fire guy. He's able to tie him up completely, or Todoroki, before he's able to react, right? Do you accept that? Yeah, what what kind of speed? How fast is that? How fast are these characters? Okay, Um. well, we know that all the My Hero characters are baseline FTL, at least. Do I need to pull out the... Remember, I went on, like, a a two-week tangent on this? 
Why are they FTL? What's the feed again? I'm not very versed in my hero. I got you. Where's it at? And if I need to post the um, all the, here, I'll just post all the evidence. It's gonna be like ten or fifteen scans. So if you don't mind, so are, they, are these like light speed feeds? Or? Yeah, it's uh, it's gonna be eleven scans. We can go through them. If, oh shoot, I can only upload ten. Your time? Okay. Give me just one second. I got you. They're all here at the bottom, so it's not gonna. It's not too bad. I almost uploaded Hashi's meme by accident. The one with the uh, hats and the hundred percents. Why this random shit? I've never heard. All right. Here we go. All right, I got you. Right here, it's eight of them. I'd, I'd cut out three files. I don't think I need them. So, if we look in the top one, um, you see all the lights in the background of the bottom part where it says, I want to be here, hero, mom and dad. You see all the lights in the back? Just wait, keep going wait, down. Wait, which one are you talking So, we're, we're going to go from top to bottom. Okay. So, the, bo so the lower, the bottom panel in the top scan, you see all the lights going across the screen. Are they stated to be light? light? What, what You'll is see. The because the it, it kind of went out of order. It kind of went out of order, so I'm going to explain it. So you see how the ice is enveloped in light, right? Go one scan down. Look in the top right panel. There's a bunch of lights going across the screen. Cool. Um, even here, look in the bottom right. You see Aoyama is being tied up um, by one the of the other there? characters. Yeah, the um. Yeah, so he's being tied up, and if you look at the scan below, um, Aoyama's lasers are indeed light. Um, is there like, like a statement? Yeah, it even says, I can also, so 13, the black hole hero, he's one of the professors. He says, I can also absorb light, and then Aoyama sees him absorbing his laser, and then he gets scared. I mean, something seen... stated to be like, you know, obviously when making it him in light speed, because, you know, the problem yeah, is but light we're showing you all the things, right? So, okay. you're, you say that, but again, this is a this is a professor at the most prestigious high school of heroes. I'm saying, does it show the properties of light? Does it refract? Does it have yeah. some mass? If you, see his, you see his, you see his, yeah. um, his costume refracts light. Those are mirrors on the bottom of his knees where it's coming out of his knees. If you look at the shoulder and the middle scan, those are mirrors all over his suit that allow him to shoot his lasers out of his shoulder. The lasers refract off of this, right? Yes, that's that's how they fire because they normally come out of his belly button. Okay. So they they refract the mirrors that come out. Okay. And then if you look below, thirteen is explaining his quirk. He's a black hole hero, so he's able to trap light in his quirk. And then you see scans of Me uh, Minata. Or Ashido able to dodge his uh, light speed attack. Yeah, do you have a, do you have a cap for that? Because you know, oh, it's just I'm not cap. It's just a baseline FCL. I mean, you it could be a rel it could be a relativistic feat. It's definitely not because it. if you look at she the first aim skill, dodged it. Yeah, it's definitely not aim dodging because if you look in the middle one, you see her look directly at the laser as it's coming, and then she ducks her head because he fires his naval laser, and then she looks at it and ducks her head. That's a FCL feat. I mean, that, yeah, because, like, she didn't completely dodge it. She just, like, you know, slightly dodged it by ducking her back in her head. So it could be a relative. Back of her head, she ducks her entire body. Look. She bends over she her back. Her it, could be, it could be a relativistic, like, a high-end relativistic reaction. Yeah, no, that's, that's faster like, that's faster like, oh, you don't have to accept it. But that's I mean, more, that's more than enough for the judges. It could be yeah, you don't, I don't yeah, actually have to prove anything to you. Good. This is more than enough for the judges. Also, why, does, does, does and then if you look at the bottom, it shows him being a disco ball. Does this include her combat speed? Well, it has to be her. She's fighting him. She's fighting him and she wins. She is? I thought she was just running away and she just dodges the laser. If you look at the bottom, the bottom, you, go, if you see her dodging the, the lasers. And then she's able to dodge it to a point to where she can move in and attack him. I mean, the um, anyway, history. Did she, 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 she,
No, she because he he's stationary when he fires in this part of the um series. And she like, so she know, just runs up to him because he has to wait one second in between firing. So she she gets up to him real close and just she uses her her acid and her because she has an acid quirk, and her acid quirk melts the um naval equipment he has on his belly button where he controls his laser and. So his laser doesn't fire off constantly. He has to cover himself up with what remains of the refractor. And his shoe wins because he can't continue. And then he went to the bottom. You see that he indeed is indeed light. Her reaction is... speed would maybe be that fast, but it wouldn't inherently scale to her combat speed because she didn't like blitz the laser. Okay. Well, again, I don't have to convince you. I just have to convince the judges, which that is a light speed reaction and combat feat. Because she's able to get close enough while dodging his laser constantly. To well, um, you can continue, though. We can leave that up to you guys. You don't have to. No. Um, and then we go from there. Let me get the other speed feats. So we've established a racer head has um, at least FTL reaction. Do you accept that? Well, we'll, we'll leave it up to the judges on whether who won their point or not. We don't have to keep going back. Okay, that's fine. And here we see a racer head fighting this villain. I mean, so I know there's the stand for, like, the fucking, um, tug of war. But, um, yeah, the race is there to find this villain. How fast is this villain? What is he FTL as well? Well, he's able to fight. So, um, let me get finished posting the scans before we go any further. Because this villain's able to, to fight and, um, outmaneuver a racer head who was able to fight Todoroki, et cetera, et cetera. I'm not just lining up everything for you to see how fast the villain is, right? Just so I can give you some context. And then Eraser Head gets the better of him right there. Yeah. And then, luckily, these are much easier to see than the other ones. Um. Eraser, um, like beating up this villain, does this lead to something? Or? Yeah. Yeah. I just lost my spot. One second. And then the villain's able to to um outpace Eraser Head, and you see Eraser Head clearly sees his acknowledges his extra arms, um, but is unable to to block them in time. Can you? And he gets nagged. He gets nagged right. into the wall. Well, it looks like he he couldn't really do anything because um, yeah, even if you, that's how much faster this here, this villain is. Wait, this villain's wait, that much you, faster than Eraserhead. This dude just looks like a lot physically stronger than him, you know, based off what we see. And it's not that he couldn't necessarily react. It looks like that he couldn't have done anything because all his rope was like tangled up. Yeah, so it doesn't look like. But that's not true because you see him, you see him jumping around while his rope's tied up already in the first place. Yeah, but all of it's tied up now. It doesn't look like he that's, got blitz. It just look. It looks like more so um that it's um, not, he couldn't do anything in that. Place. Like if you look um, in the scan, you know his all of his he, has, so. he has plenty around him to move, so that's not the case at all. Is he is this dude consistently faster than him? Because it looks like a, yeah, that's yeah. when they fought. He got absolutely just de destroyed, and then the, he runs down an alleyway um, and runs into this unnamed character. That's just what he's called, unnamed character for right now. Um, he hasn't been his identity has yet to be revealed. And then he does. Where's that? After this, we can talk about Sasuke Street. That's fine. And then he's able to do this. Um, whoops, out of out of order. Way out of order. Yeah, I did premise this with it takes me a while to get scans because of mobile. Yeah, that's fine. Um. Here we go. And then he's able to um, right. pretty much one-shot one, one shot drop him without him being able to react. And let me premise this really quick. I have the scans right here to show what happens in um, his time or his accelerated state right here. Now, these are definitely going to post out of order, so I'll tell you which order to read them in when they pop up. Okay, so we go um, number two. So he, the guy gets shot in the leg, right? He goes down. They get him crossed. Now you go to the next scan down. And he says, there we go. He says, oh, that hurts for real. You really shot me. 
just some dinky rubber bullets. No wonder they didn't hold back. You see how no one's moving there, right? You go up to um, the top scan now. He just goes along and just shoots the guy um, a bunch of times. And then at the very bottom, it all happens at once, right? Okay, what does this mean? Okay. It's a bunch of police officers. Yeah, but you see, he said the, he did the exact same thing to that villain that was um absolutely destroying. Is, is this is this is this like shown or stated? Or yeah. Here, I'll, just, I'll I'll let me show the rest of the scans that come with this villain, and you'll understand what I mean. Hopefully, you understand now, but that's fun. I'll post the rest of the scans I have with this villain to make it faster. Okay, whoops, I almost posted a Naruto scan. That would have been funny. So this is like the rest of it, what happens. Um, ignore the middle one. So the way it works is he's moved so fast that he blurs out on the panel. Um, the attacks land in the second panel. The third panel um, is just from my own reference, so ignore that. It got pulled in. Then he says the perfect counter to your um, eight-arm rush, right? So he's able to move so fast that he does the same exact thing he did to the villain that was destroying your racer head to, um, to, to the police officer. So it's the same exact feat. Well, it looks like... And the calc for this is right. So if you have someone that has FTL reaction speed, um, which means they can react to faster than light attacks, correct? Um, if they have so to clear that fast, yeah. Yeah. So if we assume that um, even in the, even in the um, fight against the monster, right, he's able to walk up to the monster, release an entire barrage of punches, and then walk, I'll lowball and say five meters away from him. Because the guy is um, stated to be like 160 centimeters. So we'll just say he walked five meters away from him. Would you agree to that number? I mean, I don't, I don't really, it doesn't really matter if you agree to it. But we're going to guesstimate and say that's five yeah, meters. Just, just continue. Yeah. So if we assume he walked five meters away, and then based on what most reliable sources say in regards to calcing things, understanding still, we'll assume the villain was able to move at a snail's pace, right? So a snail's pace is um, a millimeter. So he would have had to move 5,000 times faster than that villain. 5,000 meters at the time the villain used, moved one millimeter. And if we, count, if we um, adjust this to light, so the, the villain being unable to react to someone this fast, he moved the five meters or so. Wait, before why would he have to be 5,000 times faster? He could have just blitzed I just that showed you. Just been that, much. that dude could but again say he's like 1.5. Yeah, I just explained it. Let's just say he's 1.5. You just, you just agree that it was five meters. So you don't, need, you don't have the backpedal and try and debate the point. I said if they were hypothetically this fast, I said sure because I didn't want to like, you know, keep going back and forth on it. But let's say that dude's 1.5 times the speed of light. That other dude could have been like three times the speed of light and just blitzed him and then just yeah. walked away. After. But it wouldn't have been a standstill like you demonstrated before. That's that's what he can do. To, him to throwing that barrage of punches just means that he's just that much faster than that dude. He's unquantifiably fast. Yeah. Well, again, we we know how we know how this ability works. He performed the same feat against those police officers, which I would I argue. I mean, those police officers the heroes are water as hell. Yeah. Not really. Uh, most of the humans in My Hero Academia are white speed. Well, I don't know why those officers would even ever be there. And it isn't inherently um, well, the they same don't, They don't they inherently really need to be. We just know that they are. And I have scans of... Where is he at? Okay, so I didn't scan to get the scan of Knuckle Duster. This guy, he was able to fight um, a racer head, all day losing. That's not a racer head, but he was able to fight a racer head and, and lose. But he was able to, again, he's a human with no quirk. A racer head couldn't erase his quirk because he doesn't have one. So we do have quirkless humans who are able to fight it. Um, well, that would obviously be like a superhuman, you know, obvious. But no, the, no, officers again, wouldn't, the officers wouldn't yeah, inherently but, scale to that. That would just be like, you know, weird. No, I'm not, that's not what I'm saying. I'm saying humans are light speed in my hero. That's all I said. There's one human that is that fast. Sure, that human. And he's a hero as well or a villain. No, he's not. He's neither. 
<laughs> no, so he's a vigilante. He's literally just a random guy that goes around and tries to protect people. He's a vigilante. He's a quarterly vigilante. Yeah, that's just one human. That wouldn't inherently mean all the humans, especially regular people. Again, this would this would put um this this villain at and, and like I said, that that dude can just been we, times faster than him. We can, been argue, faster. we can we can all might to being as slow as this villain is. And that would put All Might at five thousand times speed of light without with um his minimum, right? Because we know we've that. already explained why this dude could just be a couple times faster than him and that's just he just that much faster so he could blitz him that fast. Yeah, but that, that wouldn't explain the standstill at all. Standstill. What do you what standstill what do you mean? Yeah, you're just not you're not it's you've dem- demonstrated you're not paying attention during the debate. Yeah. Let me give you just one just... second to pull up the um scan for explaining All Might's um how All Might his quirk works. Give me just one second. This one's a little bit harder to find. Okay. Just because the um, they it looks the same as a, a couple other scans. I think I read it this morning. Here we go. Sorry, yeah, it was a little bit hard to find. So, um, All Might can't move at one hundred percent. He typically only moves at twenty percent of his normal power because he would create typhoons if he actually did move around at his one hundred percent. And he's telling Deku this because when All Might uses his twenty percent, he's able to use the shockwaves, and he's trying to get Deku to learn how to use shockwaves. At the, at the same time and if all might if there's no civilians around all might would be more than happy to move around since this is a neutral battlefield all might would be more than happy to move around at 100 percent. so if we baseline all might to being as slow as this villain that would put all might baseline at 100,000 times the speed of light why is it 100,000 where did you get that big sorry from? <laughs> sorry this would put baseline all might at um 25,000 times the speed of light because he can amp himself from 20% to 100%. Well, that wouldn't inherently mean speed. Is there something showing that it's speed? Uh, yes. Give me one second. Let me get past these. And um, I can go over Sasuke's speed. Um, you know the Rakage, you know, being a light speed, you know, yada yada. Yeah, you that the Rakage stayed in his um cl- his cloak one or two with speed, yeah. well, his light speed. Yeah, it's, cl- it's, cl- it's a cloak one because they would keep on the meaning to it, yeah. So, you know, it's Sasuke. Anyway, let me see what skin this is. Yeah, so whenever All Might references his um, strength, he's always, so his, his ability, his quirk, is a battery compactor pretty much. And this battery compact only pull up the skin to, Wait, where he explains his quirk to you. A lot of Hold on. Okay. I'm going to pull up the, the skin where he explains his quirk. I might just re-download it if I have to. It'll take like 30 seconds to find. It's in chapter 2 of the manga. Is this out? Okay, good. That explains what Squirt does. So if you look at the, the middle scan, sorry, I had to post them all to see what they said. He states, um, it's true, I've barely enough. I'm weakening faster than I expected, but I've got no choice. And then if you look um, in the very top scan, it says, oh, yeah, I'm slowing down. In my heyday, five of those punches would have been enough. He constantly correlates his speed to his strength because if you look here, the quirk, the way the, the, work, the quirk works is that one person cultivates it and then passes it to another. It, the quirk is pretty much a batter where he's just drawing on the power. So he could put all the power of the quirk into speed. He can put it all into everything. But the way All Might does it, as demonstrated throughout, All Might uses it throughout his entire body. 
which is what was explained earlier when he was telling Deku. To just I don't see a scan of him correlating his power with his speed. I'm just um, seeing that he said he can go 100 percent power. Yeah, but it does it does say it because he, he's constantly correlating the two back and forth. Which one? He says which I'm scan? at left. I'm weakening faster than I thought. And he's like, which, yeah, I'm which, definitely slowing down. Which scan is this? Those would have been um, a combination of the third and first scan of the five I posted. He third, talks about how his time third. and his, his so his time his power correlated. And then the top point he talks about slowing down and his power going down. It's, it's all correlative to each other. But again, the stuff for the judges to decide. Um, but it, it was like in context, him slow, slowing down is referring how his um how he's just like getting weaker with his power. Exactly, to, it's like, all it, it's one quirk because All Might only uses the singular mean, quirk of the power. He just meant like that. He knows he's just in general getting weaker. It didn't necessarily mean directly correlated to speed. And even if he did, it wouldn't inherently be linear anyways. It could just be an unquantifiable amount. Yeah, it's it's mul- it's multiplicative by when his fight with Bakugo. Why is it multiplicative in that fun? Because he went from 5 to 8 percent. He went from being toyed around with Bakugo to blessing Bakugo. Hold on, let me on Sasuke speed on. Um, okay, sure. And that's so, um, um, Sage Naruto wasn't um, confident that he could um, beat um, MS Sasuke. He just wasn't. He just said even at he just said at that point he just couldn't beat him. And um. That um sage yeah, that same well, sage yeah, we saw having Sasuke him. just like toy around with him Yamato Sakura and Sai that he just toyed them all around. That, that's not MSO. And then in um hold on let me post this. Yeah, that was heavy Sasuke, which is even slower. Where is this scan at? I know I have it. And do we need to go over um All Might's and All Might's pre cardinal? Do we need to go over that or no? Hold up, let me find this one scan that I'm looking for. But basically, um, that um sage mode, he's Naruto just says his sage mode is faster than his KCM, and you know KCM has that 76, 72 times FTL count. You know what I'm talking about, the one that Perry did. Nope. Hold up, I don't. I don't Hold debate up. Naruto. Hold I literally up. read 200 pages just for this debate, and that's it. Mm-hmm. Where's that scan at? Um. Which is why I don't accept the multi-continental stuff because I'm, I don't, I've never I haven't read it, so I, I can't just take your word for it. Um, hold up, let me see. Can I find this scan? Okay. Well, do you mind if I post these real quick so I have them ready, so I don't have to find them again? Post what? I have some scans to post to go over how All Might is immune to precog. Um, it says directly in that scan how he's um. Faster in that mode and sage mode, so he would be faster in that seventy six times for like an unquantifiable amount. You know, he wasn't confident he can beat Sasuke, and him and Sasuke even clarified. Sasuke also scales to Kakashi, who um, scales to this um same Naruto. Why is he doing this? <laughs> I can't load my DM. And uh, what pre? How does he make pre cog again? Because. So I'll just post the scan. So you know, you know, not have you seen the Night Eye character on um, All Might's former um, sidekick? What? No. So All Might had a former sidekick, and his sidekick has the ability Foresight. I'll read it. Um, by touching any part of his target and matching his gaze with theirs, he's able to see the actions a person will take in advance, and he can do this for one hour. So he can see your entire. So he was able to talk to All Might. Even says, if you keep going like this, you'll class with the villain and head, and head towards a gruesome demise, one so terrible that you can't even put in the words, right? So he told All Might, because he looked in All Might's future and said, yeah, you're going to die when the next time you fight All for One. This was the precursor. Yet he fights All for One and lives. So All Might was able to bypass his foresight ability, his foresight. He can see someone's entire life. Seems like he's more of a... Um... Like a foreteller, not that he's hundred percent accurate. That he just goes no, it's, but just even see. states um, all my um, where's it saying? So he's like, so you were looking at all I told you. There's no need for you to look at me, night eye. Um, yeah. And then all my even says, and what's more, your foresight is never wrong, isn't that right? So even All Might acknowledges that his foresight is never wrong because he looks into the timeline. And, that and then that dude goes on to say that he doesn't even know if he's right because this is the first time that this situation's ever come up to where you have to predict something. So his prediction wouldn't inherently be right. That's not true. He just says there's simply no precedent for this up until now. 
what he's talking about is All Might doing what he's doing. There's no need for All Might yeah, to continue. Yeah, there was no precedent for him himself. Um, to like see something like this coming. He's like never like you know tried to predict something like this. That's not true. The context states that he's talking about even if he retire, the next time one hero will surely appear. So they're talking about All Might retiring, and he's saying there's no precedent for you actually needing to go and continue to do what you're doing. You can retire, and then that's why there's no precedent for him to keep going. It seems that. like he's more of a foreteller and not that he would just have this actively in combat. But it clearly states. Well, it doesn't mean it, it has nothing to do with content, combat, right? It has nothing. It doesn't need to be in combat. He has complete precog of someone's entire life. And All Might and Deku both, if you look to the bottom, um, in the middle, and then he's like, I'm All Might's disciple. What, did, um, what, he, what I cannot see does not change. And then it explains his quirk again. In the source of the bottom, Deku is trying to catch the little, um, it says one minute pass. He's trying to take the stamp out of his hand. And at the reality that you can't possibly fail over my foresight, right? And then he just goes over him. He tries to block his sight. He tries to do everything, but nothing affects his ability. So the only However, thing this dude can do is touch you and see, like, your, everything. your future. He, 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 touches, he touches you and sees all the movements you'll make for your entire life. For, it says for in advance for the period of the, of one hour. Yeah, so the, his ability wears off after an hour. So he can just fast forward through your life and look at everything. That's no, it looks on. like that he can see what's going to like take course for an hour. But that, again, if you read Not the structure of the sentence... He can just see what you're going to do for the next yeah, hour. But again, it's, it clearly states that he was able to see All Might die to Alpha 1. Well, well, he said, even so, the next time yeah, you fight a villain, yeah. a gruesome villain, you're going to have a gruesome demise. Well, that's because, like, you know, All Might was constantly weakening, so anybody could have seen that. It's not anything, like, crazy. But that's, not what's, that's not what's demonstrated. Especially when it's just stated that um, his, um, his like, foresight is only for hours. Yeah. You can only see an hour. But why does it show to All Might anyway? Your, your, your cynic structure, you're trying to argue um, semantics for the cynic structure, when that's clearly not the case. They're talking about he can see it, his quirk lasts for one hour on people where he can just see into their future and see everything that's going on. But that would be the same exact thing for the Sharingan, because Sharingan can see um, an undemonstrably amount of time in the future, very short amounts of time in the future. Um, I have those scans to uh, yeah, pull out as well. Precog or not. Why does this scale to All Might, though? Why does because All Might, All Might is immune to Precog because of this. How is he immune to Precog? We just talked about it for the last 15 minutes. What, what for the sake of argument, there's no need to go back to it. Precog. Because, oh my gosh, this character can see someone's entire future up until they die, and All Might was able to bypass that and change his future. He was able to break out of that okay, timeline. Did he see within that hour that he would fight off of? No. He was able to see further than just one hour. Why do you keep bringing one hour? It's, dem it's already stated that that's just the amount of time he can use it for. That's nothing to do with how far in the future he can see. And that's not inherently him negging Precog. That's just him getting yes, it is. that if he does fight all for one, you will die. And then him just going yes, to he was say, able to well, go into the future. To that was the future. That was what he was going to. That was what was it's going not to happen. Saying, it's more so of a prediction. Like it's not saying. It's that not this prediction. Is where does it say? Where does it state that he just like can just like whatever he says is just definite? So and here's your saying he's able to predict on Precog, which. You're saying that he's able to predict the future, that not in hand. He's, he's, he's not able to project it. He sees the future. It says that he's it literally, it, it literally says he predicts it. Where? Well, I just saw it. Well, keep scrolling. Because it clearly states he's able to see the actions a person will take in advance. Right. He's and then he's able to like for... be able to predict. Right. Yeah, and, because, yeah, he's not. He's not going to. So which, again, so you're like, arguing. Yeah. You're arguing what he said which to Majora. It's not like he has the Almighty like Yuha. He can just literally see the future and pick which future is the best. No, it's, it's not about so picking the future. future. He's able to see the future that's already been picked. He's able to see the defined future as it is. And he, he's telling Midoriya. He doesn't tell Midoriya what he see that about his quirk, right? He only tells Midoriya's foresight, and he's able to predict. Um, what is All Might negging? Just because he just overcame his limits? He, he, he over, no, he overcame Precog. 
which is what no, it's, it's more so that front. it's more so that um the support of everybody just gave him that confidence boost, and he gathered the last embers that was left in his soul. So he put everything he had out there to defeat all. Um. Which is, not, is him not, being able to, which is him nagging the precog. Thank you for no proving my point. suggests that he even saw All but Might he did. even um do all of that. It's more so that All Might just outdid his expectations and his prediction was just wrong because it was wrong. Since he, he, he doesn't all. predict, he clearly sees. Yeah, his and it was wrong. Yeah, this only happened once. Yeah, which is so because All Might is immune to it. That means that this particular prediction was wrong, and that anything that he it's said. Not, again, wrong. you keep using the word prediction when it's clearly he's able to actually see what's going on. And because um, later, because later on, he's able to look into a villain's future and see exactly where their hideouts are. He's able to go back and look at the hideouts where they have. Well, by the way, I where they're going. Count for my software, but um, um, does does my does um, All Might have resistance to mine? Yes. On what scale? Um, he was um. So again, Deku and All Might are pretty much the same character. Deku was able to resist being completely brainwashed to the point where his consciousness was separated from his being. Okay. And if you want, I can I can grab that real quick because I'm right at yeah, the manga yeah, chapter yeah. for that. Yeah. Okay. I'm right at the manga chapter. And then I have a scan for showing that um. There, it's perfect. I'm at the right spot. That um, because can MS Sasuke use Tsukiyomi? Yes. No, he can't. Okay. Uh, he doesn't. Because the crows aren't Tsukiyomi, by the way. Just letting you know. What are you talking about? Tsukiyomi is what he used against Hiroki. And what he used against Sasuke. You talking? To you. There's just yeah. saying that you must have Tsukiyomi to like you know. I have the image, so you should have to keep here. Hold up. Got some others. Um, are you aware of the universe Orochimaru created? You, it's not a universe. It is. It's just his mind it's is not, that bad. It's a, no, it's not. His it's, mind a, it's, a, it's, it's, it's a dimension. Why? It's, it's definitely not. It it's clearly the states universe. in the manga, which the manga is the primary canon. Yeah, there we go. There's the manga. State it's not a universe. universe. And Sasuke, is, it oh, is dude, that's you're so dishonest. You were, I'm a part of the scan, it? and you need to be banned from yeah, the server for being inherently dishonest. How? I, I, I literally just pulled this up that. from the manga. How am I being dishonest? Because I have the manga. I can post the kanji as well. Like, you it's find not the universe. You only really find like the rods of it. Yeah, it's definitely not a universe. You only find the rods of it, and you can look at the rods. I'll grab the rods. Where's this crap at? Um, so Sasuke is able to mind hack him and resist Sasuke and Itachi's mind hack, so they would also mind hack Sasuke. And you know his mind. Um, that well, bad, that just, so that would... well, all that proves is that um, Sukiyomi just isn't that powerful of a jutsu, and Itachi no, was like, no, that would mean uh, that Sasuke can mind hacks people that have a universal sized mind. That would be, that would be um, sure yeah, no, that's not universal. That's garbage. You need to prove that's an entire universe. It's stated to be. I wouldn't assume anything goes. All right, so do, do I need to pull out omnipotent scans for all my then? Wait, but, but because but, but this is stated to be a universe. It's it's so no, that's garbage. I'm a, I'm gonna go to the manga right now. That's no, so dishonest. Garbage. She's just verbatim. The, how, how am I being dishonest? It's literally, in Sasuke's case, able to mind X him, and you know that would be universal plus mind X, even if you lowball the infinite three D. So, and then I um, no. You need, first of all, you need to demonstrate. I got the manga right here. You need to demonstrate that it's an actual universe. It's it's stated to be, that's the only thing we have to go off of, so I wouldn't assume anything else. Oh, even more perfect. It's, it's not a universe. Where's this at? Sorry. Death of Kara. Are you aware of Amaterasu? Yeah, Amaterasu is way too slow. Cloak one, um, um, no, he was able to cast and walk around it. No, he got tagged by it too because he had to cut his arm off. No, he let himself be tagged by it because he he bolt shot him. I was like, yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and take the hit, and then he almost negs Sasuke out of existence. But it was still yeah, able to da- it was still able to damage him. Therefore, because it was bothering him so much, to where he had to cut his arm. Yeah, but that doesn't matter. He, you know, so that's only because he let him fucking hit. Well. No, I'm not, not saying I'm not because it wasn't even hurting me. It wasn't even hurting me, Rakage. 
he just couldn't put it out, so he cut his own arm off just because yeah. he's impatient. So that that Amaterasu would be above um All Might's durability, so it'd be able to just fucking vaporize his ass. Um, how was it? Uh, multi-continental. Um, it's able to damage the rock carrier. Yeah. So again, you're you're so prove to me that being able to overcome someone's entire durability wouldn't necessarily one shot them. Because that's, really, that's just a load of crap. Well, if you overcome someone's durability, it's, it's, it's it's the them. skin of the Raikage is multi-continental. In, in order to be affected, you have to be that level of multi-continental or greater. That's not true. If I punch you in the and, chest, am I going to be like, your entire durability? If I durability, yeah, you're hitting me in my heart, you know, near my heart, then yeah, that wouldn't inherit. No, that. if I just punch you in the chest, am I, by, am I bypassing your entire durability? Do I need to um, fundamentally break apart a wall to hit it with a hammer and crack the wall it, and damage it? Okay, that, you, no, you don't. Okay, you're bypassing your durability because you're particularly like aiming in a certain spot and putting more pressure on it. So, Sasuke also has the Shidori, which you, which you know that is. It can um, pierce All Might's heart. Yeah. Does you're you're arguing like any, like any of those are fast enough to hit All Might. We've already established this. Well, we leave the difference. speed up to the judges. I think I properly debunked that, but we can leave that up to the but um, debunked it. All you said was, "Oh, I don't think so." That was your argument. No, nah, that wasn't my argument. But um, do you think does all might have like regeneration or anything for, for his like, sure. heart or anything? Because Sasuke can like pierce his heart with a shidori. Yeah. Again, you're saying it like he's gonna hit all might. Hello. I think this is it right here. Actually, I was waiting for the, oh, no, the really snake. Good. Here it is. What chapter is this? Chapter. It's gay. That's really gay. Oh, I can just look up already tomorrow, Bruce. Chapter twenty four. All right, look in um, semi formal. Yeah, I'm good. Definitely, the the manga scan definitely says dimension, not universe. Um, why is this like more official? Like, why is this uh, so, like um, random webs? Random website. It's, they're actual manga scans. And, um, they're not, like, they're not fan. They're, they're not fan art like yours. Wait, why? Why is this official? I'm also watching it. I'll show you. This is from this is a scan from the from the show and jump. It's a scan from the show and jump. And this is actually the most this recent one. Here, I'll show you. This is actually the most recent one. Dang it, I've seen this Because this actually also what part chapter? of the color series. It clearly says three forty five, but this oh, is one of the show and jump. And it's the color copy. So this is the most official canon, the most recent one. Wait, wait, wait. Is this can you like show me like a source for this? Naruto Shippuden doesn't have an official color copy. Only the original Naruto does. So this would be fan once again. It's fan art. Um it clearly says I'm I'm already in Kishimoto on it. Yeah, the other I could go to the front of the other manga website and it would say the same thing. They all say that. Yep. So if you look at the text from yours, right? So look at the text from mine. And look at the text from yours. The text from yours is clearly messed up. How's it messed up? Look, it's, it's, it's different fonts. It's different boldness. It's clearly different. Whereas yeah, mine has all the same font. Let's see, can I go on here? And it might even has a source on it where yours is cropped. No, no. So, yeah, no. Uh, I think you're. It looks like you were using fan art. I mean, I don't know why yours is any more issue. It's just it says by Jap flap. I don't even know the fuck that is. And also, I give you the Ross. Do you want the Ross game so you can look at it yourself? Oh, I know that the word. I know that the um. You need to differentiate on con, um, the kanji for um, universal and a uh, universe and dimension. But it clearly says to mention, that's like saying Naruto has an entire freaking, um, this is like heavy Sasuke going inside of Naruto and popping the um, QB and saying that's universal feet. It doesn't make any sense. It's inconsistent. What? Inconsistent. Are you talking about inconsistencies now? What are you talking about? Yeah. And it's, and Itachi is um, clearly sick when he fights. Um, Do you want to go to conclusions? 
conclusions. What do you mean? Yeah. Your character just, and I haven't even got to the part where your character gasses himself out after using two or three jutsu. What but we can. Reason? Okay, we can go to conclusions. I'll start first since you started first. Okay, um, you want me to go? I can start. Um, Kappa, can I start my conclusion? Yeah, I'm eating my mind. Oh, okay. Okay, so I basically got Sasuke to um, 73 times FTL. He didn't really refute it. Um, he had his characters at um, unquantifiable FTL, and even at that, I asked for a calc of Nina dodging that ray, and I never got one, so that doesn't inherently mean that her combat speed is that fast or her reaction speed. And then um, he tried to say that his um, character was like 5,000 times FTL, and I already explained why that character could have been 1.5 F- times FTL. The other dude could have been just like, vastly slower than him so he could just look like he's that much slow slower than him in, in comparison um he really didn't debunk the universal plus um sasuke mind hacks um he didn't show um he showed um he mentioned that all might had like um he said that Midori had resistance to this mind hacks and he tried to scale it to all might but that wouldn't inherently be true also it wouldn't be um on the scale of what i explained at Rochimaru's. i mean um, that sasuke's was also proved that Sasuke was multi-continental, and then he said that um like island um um All Might was like large island level plus, and I showed several scans and several slides of scaling of why Sasuke was multi-continental, and then I also brought up Amaterasu, which I stated could vaporize All Might over time because his AP is so much high, um, higher. He didn't bring up a counter to Shidori because um he didn't bring up that All Might had regeneration at all for vital organs. He also didn't bring up a counter to Mind Hacks. And um, he didn't really get his characters to a legitimate speed, so yeah, I think I won. You can go, Kappa. Okay. Um, I'm not going to address my opponent, my conclusion, or introduce new um, material, which is what we're not supposed to do. But I demonstrated that when we're comparing characters, we need to um, provide justifiable um, movements for characters. I gave evidence to where all the characters in my hero are bare minimum baseline FTL. Um, the um, Ashida was definitely not aim and dodging. She clearly saw the light and was able to dodge it. They scale all to each other. Then we have a character that comes along and is able to move at such a rate at which the FCL characters are set in sudden place. I gave a small short count that was really simple for him on why he'd be 5,000 times faster. He was able to move five meters. And that's just, I mean, that's granting. Um, the idea that he only moved 5 meters when he clearly was able to cover the guy's entire body. The monster was 15 meters tall and he was able to cover his entire body in punches. Um, comparing that to a snail's pace, which is what Versus Wiki uses as a minimum for seeing things moving um, not at all, which the character didn't do. That would make him 5,000 times faster than the character that was consistently FTL basing off the other characters. Then we have um, AP, we have Sasuke constantly gassing and stuff out. Every, after using just one MS ability, um, the Susano, he was gassed out. He used Amaterasu right after that. He started bleeding from his eyes. He was even more pain. He used way more chakra. He started to lose his vision. And then um, we saw All Might would be immune to the precog. We saw that Night Eye's future side ability was completely superior to the just moments use of the, of the Sharing Gun, whereas the Foresight was demonstrably able to see an entire future, and All Might was able to neg that. And then I brought up, the last point I brought up was Medoya beating um, the Mind Hacks user. The Mind Hacks user was able to completely brown, uh, brainwash um, Mido. Mido is, is essentially the same exact character as All Might, just weaker and slower. Um, so Sharingan Gun wouldn't work, more, more, more on the MS wouldn't work, because he has souls inside of him to break up, which was the end point of what I was doing. The speed difference is too great, stamina difference is too great, um, yeah. And I've d- demonstrated that characters in Naruto constantly lose their durability when they're low on chakra and caught off guard, and I end my debate. I'll mute. When you retard Judge. Go first, Jojo. No, I said you go first. God damn it. No, you're going. I'll flip, I'll flip a coin. Pick, pick one. Can pick you all remove our debate roll? Heads. Heads. Hey, I, I got you. I got you. I'll, I'll remove it. It was heads, Jojo. Oh, 
So since I picked heads, you go first, man. <sighs> mm-hmm. Okay. When do you guys judge? <clears throat> um, did, did you flip your damn coin? Yeah, I flipped it. It was heads. Yeah, yeah, was was. <clears throat> All right, so I'm going. <clears throat> yeah. All right. All right. Fuck you. All right. <clears throat> so I do think that Tay did um prove that he had a higher AP than Kappa did. But um, I do. Th- I don't think I ever heard Tay properly respond to Kappa's um, mat like massively fat bastion like uh, um <clears throat> argument, and like Kappa said, he didn't really really preface it. He just said, "No, I I just think that's a bit absurd." But then again, he kind of also did that for the universal feat um for mind hacks, and he kind of and he just rejected the comp when um. <clears throat> When Tay was gonna bring up the kanji scan, he then just decided to reject it. So I do like um, Tay won that point, but I also do 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 believe that the. <clears throat> Sorry if I'm caught, if I clear my throat a lot, but uh, I do believe um, because Kappa got his speed higher, and I believe they both agreed that <clears throat> if you're if you get blitzed or if um if your guard is down basically if you speed blitz then um you should be able to one shot the other character. I believe that was the preface into the bait, so I believe Kappa won. Okay. I yeah. guess I'll go now. Uh, <laughs> I thought that Tay got the speed argument across. Because okay. he kept um asking Kappa to correlate the the like increase in the in the like the percentages and how fast he would get in comparison. Kappa did prove that he got faster, but then Tay just brought up how he could get an unquantifiable amount faster every time. And Kappa never mm-hmm. quantified it. The only thing Kappa tried to give for a quantification, um, past just being faster than light, was that one thing where he um where where that one guy was fighting the villain. And uh, Tay asked Kappa to quantify this, like give a, give speed for that villain, like scaling to put him at faster than light, and Kappa didn't give anything. So I do think Tay won. Okay, Jaja. Go retard. Uh, I guess I'm the tiebreaker, huh? Okay. Uh, well, to address earlier on, I think Kappa did do a good job on debunking the data rescaling. For the most part, uh. Tay still scaled uh, Sasuke to like other multi continental level characters, so he definitely got him stronger. Uh, Tay's speed scaling was very like straightforward, you know, 73 times FTO. Uh, Kappa speed scaling, uh, Tay was asking like for him to prove the multiple, t- multiple, sorry, I can't speak, multiplicative differences between like the percentages of uh, the one for all quirk or whatever and Kappa wasn't really going about proving that also the snail space thing like Tay also brought up the possibility of just like blitzing in general you don't have to be that much faster you know you can blitz while being like two times 1.5 times faster so I don't think Kappa really got that speed argument across really well Tay also brought up like uh better mind hacks uh and yeah so he kind of like Tay had like a faster quantifiable FTL, stronger character, better mind hex, and yeah, I think he won. Yep, I don't think you guys listened to the same uh, debate I did because I'll uh, I'll start with Naya. Hold on, I'll start with Naya. Naya, how do you, how do you how do you come and how do you listen to the debate and say I didn't prove the villain was like um fat, like FTL quantifiably when I scaled him to all the other characters that were demonstrably FTL. You didn't give any scaling for him. What do you mean? I posted in t- I posted like thirty scans in a row showing this character's relative to this character's relative to this character relative to this character. I showed Bakugo, I uh, showed Midoriya and um, freaking Todoroki, who scaled to um, Ashido, and then Eraserhead scales to them. This villain completely outpaced Eraserhead. 
And then this guy does the same standstill thing he did with the police and just one-shot him. What do you mean I didn't bring up scaling? I no, spent 15 minutes doing that. Still all it's not. Five. I just yeah. I explained why it wasn't because of the snail's pace. Because VS uh, versus Wiki pulls up a, a, a pretty much the, the the standard of which we go by for the snail's pace. Snail moves a millimeter, and you move whatever distance. Correct? Is that not how we do standstill stuff? Or no? And how is someone that's twice as fast as you moving while you're at a standstill? If you're running at eight miles an hour, they're running at sixteen miles an hour. You're not at a standstill. So I don't understand how you guys got to that conclusion. And even if you were you... faster, All Might could never damage Sasuke. I already explained why they We've already demonstrated that when they lose. I don't see any I don't see any um scans after the ones you posted of that guy blitzing the villain where that no, villain's it's before that. again. Keep go before keep that. scrolling up. All the ones before that were of the villain fighting and then of a racer head fighting and then of Todoroki fighting and then oh yeah, it's, it just goes all the way up. And then because you have Mina right proving the FTL and then Aoyama's laser being a laser, and then you have Todoroki and Bakugo uh, Todoroki and Midoriya fighting. You know you might one argument to that. I asked for a count because that wouldn't inherently yeah. be a... What do you mean? That could I be realistic count. She Even if it was well domestic, it would still put All Might at baseline 500 times faster than Light, which, again, is nine times faster than your character. Even if we kept it at relativistic, because relativistic is a uh, bare minimum, what, 10% speed of Light? 1%? Uh, no, that's sub buddy. Oh, shit, yeah, my bad. Whoa. So that would still put in there. Even if you, even if you just reject the idea that she, her being able to see the laser being fired at her, and then reacting to it when it's inches from her face is an FTL. And then I also went over why them being off guard when it inherently dropped their durability. But we showed show that Gara, you argue that Gara has multi-continental durability, and I showed that Gara was dropped. Okay, that just means that Data, hats. and I told you that it just means Data was higher into multi-continental. I literally said that. And then you tried to bring that up against Kisame, and I told you why, Kisa, why that wouldn't work for Kisame either. But again, we demonstrated that all might the lower the chakra gets, damage. the lower the durability gets. We demonstrated that. No, you didn't. You just kept saying that because it happened in that one instance. You didn't show that. And then I asked you to prove back. your calcs for um, all the BG being I, I most dro- continental, which you cal- didn't. I dropped No, he, he, sent, he, sent, he sent a calc for it, and you didn't say yeah. anything about it. The only he calc he dropped was, let's see, the Rakaga. No, I dropped no, the multi-continental no, he, did, he, did drop, he did drop the multi-continental and I, one. And I kept trying to tell you, but you kept saying I was talking over you and interrupting you. So I just wait, got like, you want to keep bullshitting on that point? <laughs> you, you didn't refute the Shidori. You didn't prove all so my head. the thing you, is, right, it even, it head clearly head states head. that's Naruto and B. That's both of their BG Dama, correct? So again, yeah. you didn't prove that individual BG were multi-continental. Yeah, that's no, 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 that's the nine tails Cap, 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 at, this, Cap, at this point, you're like you're like nitpicking because it's like pretty pretty like into multi-continental. It's not even just baseline. Like yeah. divided by two, it's still multi-continental. So. Which is what I told you. But wait, hold on. We know, know that the nine tails is thousands of times stronger than the other Biju, correct? Okay. So no, it's not just two times. That's just that's and, just. And then fallacy. I also brought up how the Rakage was going to damage Casey and Naruto, who you said was small planetary. And then oh, I never said Casey and Naruto was small planetary. You did, and you never provide a count for that no, when I asked no, for no. Kushina yeah. being yeah. small planetary. You, you, you did. You didn't ask for. You no, said, I didn't. Said, you said Kurama was like small planetary. KCM still. And I said why KCM would be full Kurama anyway. And you didn't refute that. And I said why well, the Rakage was going to damage yeah. you. No. Sasuke I literally there. stated yeah. wasn't yeah, said, Kurama's a... No. No, you, you were talking about... Kappa, you brought up how um how Naruto would end up scaling to the full Kurama, who's like small planetary, right? And then he was just like, how did Naruto uh, win the chakra struggle and still end up being multi-continental afterward? And he said, okay. because Kushina helped him. And then... No, said I, never say that, I never said that. I never said that. Because... The, uh... I don't know where you guys heard that argument from. You I'm said nine tails was no, you, small planetary. You, you did bring that up, and then and then later asked him to prove that he was small planetary, and then he brought up the statement of the of the nine tails being able to turn the world to ash. Yeah, and then I said that big you can break all things on the land as well. Like, uh, which would be another multi-continental statement. 
So basically, even if I steal Man Demon Say All Might was fast, he would never be able to damage Sasuke. He couldn't resist the mind hex, and he couldn't take a shoot because he doesn't have any regen. Not the Chicho, anyways. Yeah. My only question is, where are you getting like the snail pace uh, thing in versus battle? Tip because if another, so if you have two people moving, another person isn't moving in the scan. Like there's no movement from the character, and the other character is able to move around freely. We have to assume at minimum they're moving in a scale snail pace. Because we have to assume there's some type of movement. Otherwise, it would be infinite. Right? All right. So the fact that there was a character who was faster than light, that was unable to move at all, right? He performed the same feat he did against police officers. And again, those police officers are trained to fight um, people that, are, that are, have quirks. And the fact that um, baseline I people... I already explained to you why they wouldn't quirks. be FTO. At no, all. you didn't. Oh, you yes, said it was over the police officers. You brought, it, that's yeah, not you brought up one character no. being FTL, and I told you that's just an outlier, and he's a superhuman. He did. He did ask for like scaling for like uh, police officers to this like one FTL, for, like regular human. No, his only argument was that's an outlier. Yeah, it um, would be. It's only one yeah. human that's shown to be out that's, that fast. That's but we see police officers constantly fighting, was... fighting fighting court villains who are all FTL. Because so that's one human. That wouldn't inherently mean all the human skeletons. Himawari reacted to a light speed attack. I'm not going to say all humans in Naruto are just fucking FTL. That don't, yeah. Like, what the hell? Like, if he, th him saying he's an outlier would be a proper refute since you did bring up one human out of, like, the whole civilization of regular humans. Yeah, but again, but Deku was also a normal human who was able to have faster and light combat speed. You didn't bring that up in the debate. I guess that's two versus millions, then. You didn't bring up, like, uh, Deku pre-Quirk doing any FTL reaction for you. you never did. But again, all the quir all the people I brought up that had Quirks, only Deku's was a uh, stat booster. No one else I already has told you, even if I gave you the speed, you would never be able to damage Sasuke. So you, your only argument is that no matter how weak and how little Chakra they have, they have continent, multi-continental durability is your argument. Which you Why would Sasuke his chakra be any lower just because Sas just because All Might blitzed him, even if he was faster? Why would his like durability? Which this is the part we didn't get. To. Well, I did bring up that Sasuke using three jutsu was gassed against Itachi, right? And, I, and then I he asked, used like, and then he used my Deku Sharingan that? one time against. And I asked what did he mean by that? And did we never win anything in in Dale in deeper into it? Yeah. Okay, even if Sasuke was in base, his durability would still be the same. And then All Might would never damage him, and then Sasuke would just one-shot him when he's able to tag him. Like, I don't, in I character, don't, right. So, I don't know in why, character, I don't know why Sasuke All goes Might straight for Sharingan. Okay, but uh, no, isn't, isn't the debate non Gekyo Sharingan? Yeah, yeah so, so he wouldn't be in base, and in start. he spams his MS. Even during the fight, yeah, where I he spammed it. The fight with Danzo, he spammed it. But you didn't actually bring that up. We never got into that. We just went to conclusions. Yeah. And then I think it's funny you guys went over the fact that he brought up a dishonest scan in the middle of the debate. What dishonest scan? Is that's that's, that's, that's very really clearly. No, that's no, very that clearly is, that is, that is the, no, that is the V scan. That is the V yeah, scan. The V scan. I, didn't, I know because I gave it. I'm, I'm so baffled. I'm so baffled that you, that you even tried to say oh, that that oh. was a dishonest What do you mean? And, and, and then, so he, he and brought up he a also, crop scan, no, and I'm not supposed to question no, it. He brought up a crop not, scan. It, okay, no, it's fine that you it's fine that you question it, it. You know, for it being a crop scan, but um, yeah, it was the that is the vis translation, and then you like um, what 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 baffles me is that you um gave a fan translation to try to go against it. You know, it, you can literally see the the manga reader dot net watermark in the corner of your oh, screen. Yeah, even even if it wasn't like fucking. So and, then, and, then, and then he and then he offered to give you the, he offered to give you the kanji, and then yeah, um, but what good would the kanji do if, if neither of us are professor in Japanese? Original, the the original original scan. Scan. He can translate it. Yeah, he could. Yeah, like how do you know he he doesn't know any amount of Japanese? Like the, he would have offered, correct? Which he didn't. So I can't he assume offer, he knows he Japanese. Did offer, he, he did offer. Yeah, he offered to it. give you the yeah, to he give you the scan. He, he offered to give you the kanji scan. Yes, and then I yeah, said uh, well, yeah, we couldn't read it wrong. anyway. I clearly said wrong. we couldn't read it, so it wouldn't matter. And he did not offer to translate it. Yeah, and then no, I explained that. If I say we can't read it and he doesn't offer to translate it, I can't know he can translate it. I mean, what else would he be doing? Would he right, just, like, so... give an untranslated scan for no reason? That doesn't make any sense. If I say well, I can't read it and he doesn't offer, I can't assume he can read it then, can I? 
thing. He was offering. <laughs> it's the Viz translation anyway. It just doesn't matter. Like, I don't he could li- he could literally just grab like the kanji and then show you like this means this. You know, like. And then your only course of argumenting that would have to be that it's metaphorical, which would imply that you know Japanese. So, I mean, and I have scans yeah. that I know Japanese, so I could have translated it for y'all, but. He did get his Kevin, mind hacks Kevin, higher. Like he plus, it wasn't repeated doing? properly. He what? didn't get his mind hacks higher. That's the problem. Kevin, he did. Kevin, what's it? Kevin, what's this weird thing you kept doing in the? And yeah, he definitely got the mind hacks higher. He, he, he brought up like several mind hacks feats in the level. But, um, what was what was this weird thing you kept doing whenever Tay was just like to buy time so that I don't have to go look for the scan myself? Can someone just <laughs> like? Post the scan, like post the count for me if they have it on hand, or post the scan for me because he he's already addressing that it exists and is making an argument with it. So someone else posting the scan form so that he doesn't have to go look for it is just it's just like trying not to to be tedious and waste time. Like there's nothing wrong with that. That's not outside help because they're not making the argument for him. I still, you would still consider that outside help because he didn't come prepared to the debate, right? So if you need someone to go and look for stuff for you and gather information for you that you haven't gathered okay. before the debate, no, you, then you, that you would just be dishonest. You, you, you don't, you don't have to always have prep during the debate. And no, it's dishonest. It's dishonest to try to say that that's outside help. Yeah, like it, that's can, not demonstrably can, dishonest at all. all yes, right, it Capo. is. Wait, it, wait, it, wait. it is. It is. Whenever Dial. you're trying to say that he he's automatically conceding because he doesn't have a scan that he already knows exists. And doesn't want to go look for it, and instead is asking someone else that already has it on hand to give it to him, so he doesn't have to waste time. All right. you're, you're being like really tedious, like intentionally. All right, Kappa. That, that's very dishonest. Like, All right, Kappa. Let me yeah. Give you an example, so, quick. Imagine, like, I work at a comic store, right? and I refuse to pirate scans, so I'm only gonna like use comics I have scanned in personally for my own collection, right? And we're debating something, and I, I'm like. In Action Comics number five from 1940, whatever, Superman does this. I'm using this feat. You ask me for a scan, I'm like, hold on, I don't have that scan in. Let me go fetch it to my collection, which will take like 30 minutes. Or if someone has it, they can post it for me. Now, clearly, in that situation, I know exactly where it is, how I would get it, all that. And all I'm doing is just skipping the wait that if I had to go do it myself, opposed to someone who might have it already. Maybe they pirated it, and I'm against that, or whatever. And with Tay's example, Tay knows exactly where to find these because he's describing them vividly. In fact, I'm pretty sure we've had debates in here where I've had to explain to people that if you're able to describe a scan vividly, I will give it to you. Just because I don't feel like waiting yeah, for you. Really to really scan it's, it's, it's the scan of Kisan. The only scan somebody posts for me is the scan of somebody uh, being um, the Rakage cutting Kisane's head off. We both knew that existed. Because you even pointed out how he was weakened at that time. So we both knew it existed. We also pointed out how he turned into um, Sami Hada. So we both knew it existed. We just wanted to see it. So you knew the scan existed, and so did I. So it wasn't even that. So, so it doesn't matter that I knew it existed, right? The fact that we chose to make, it, make this a semi-informal debate, and it was a 1v1, meant that you're not supposed to be getting outside help. Right. Uh, outside help. He's directly aware of the scan. I just explained but, the analogy, and you had no qualms with it, Kappa. You had a qualm with why we allow people to do that here. You yes, qualm- the, the problem is he didn't know where it was, otherwise he would have had it, correct? Yeah, he did. He knew how to find it. it you but know, no, I know he how to find it and, and not having it aren't the same right, thing. So, no, it, it doesn't matter. If I can go why find you, like, why, did, uh, why, 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 did, why did you just say that, Kappa? That's like the equivalent of saying, like, that, like I, I can prove to you that, like, several miles down the road, there's this rock, like, sitting on this doorstep. <laughs> And then someone else that's in the same room with me has a picture of that rock, like, already, you know, at, at that doorstep and can demonstrate that it's where I'm talking about. And, and you're telling me that what, what, you, what you're telling me right now is even though I'm describing to you exactly how I would go about proving it, and this guy already has the evidence that I'm talking about, that I don't know how to prove it because, because I'm not going and, and walking several miles down the road to take a picture. When this guy already has the picture that I would be taking, that wouldn't even if even if I didn't have that scan, that wouldn't have changed anything in the debate. Can you point out something that that would have inherently changed? 
wouldn't have changed anything since we both knew it existed. Well, you, you you didn't have any of the cows. You you asked help for each cow. No, I dropped... did. No, he did. He did. He did get the cows. He dropped the speed so... and multi-continental one. Yeah, but he asked for both of them. But nobody he dropped. And, 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 and he ended up dropping. And he ended up dropping them. Yeah. So he it, just wasted his time. Which is fine, right? But if he has to ask yeah, people yeah. for help, but they didn't. He, he has his hand the whole time. He's not, oh, he's it, not is, it is literally he asking for help. He, did, he, did, he didn't have it. He didn't have it the whole time. He went and looked for it because you asked for it and 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 like demanded that no one else give it to him, even though he already knew that it existed and already it, knew where to find it. Yeah. And just asked so just, someone else had it. On so the even account. if I know it exists, right, but I can't produce it as evidence, doesn't mean I can use it in a debate. Which is why I wanted him to provide the evidence, not someone well, else. I did drop the if, Andrew, hold on, Andrew, hold on. Andrew, Andrew, because Andrew. if he could, which because someone gave it to you probably. But if, if so, if he couldn't find the calc, even the though he knew it existed, he couldn't have used it without providing the calc itself. The only calc, the only thing that somebody dropped for me was the Kisame cutting off anything. We both knew that it just so it wouldn't have changed anything when we made it. If hypothetically he couldn't have found it. Right, like, like let's say for instance like um, the calc blog was taken down or something and internet archive didn't have it which by the way I think we um, if you guys are using calcs on VSB back them up on internet archive you know be a real one but um, <clears throat> like let's say hypothetically he doesn't and then you could challenge the validity, validity of the calc or uh, call Hitchens Razor well until then because he's describing it vividly and it does exist we all know it exists I'm pretty sure at this point and all that's changing is hey like me on a laggy phone can go get it and it will take me time or someone who has it bookmark on a very fast computer can just dump it real fast and all that changes is the time and the situation there's no problem with the faster person doing it yeah. at all it, it's uh, literally you... like like kappa it's like if you complained about about the store because someone in a Ferrari went and picked them up instead of like your mom in a minivan. And that's a false equivalence. No, it's not at all. It's the same raspberries you're getting. It's not the same raspberries. It is the same. It's the same. The, the principle is not the same. Yeah, it is. It's completely the same. Because Tay you're not getting the same end product. He knows how to get the calc, where the calc is, what it shows, and he probably even has a high and low end. It's exactly the same. Yeah. Um, but again, the problem you, is the fact that if he described it but didn't have it, you can't use it. Well, I did yeah, drop it. Have it and, and I don't know why you guys are surprised because every time I actually do a debate, um, I've always done this. I don't allow outside help. I, I, I asked for anything specific, so I don't know why you guys are like getting so nasally. And I don't know why we're still talking about this when I did drop it, so it is very irrelevant. Very irrelevant. Because now I brought it up. That's why we're talking about it. Well, it is very relevant. Well, no matter who brought what's it up. The problem? <laughs> What surprises what surprises me that is that you're trying to say that the opposite is is dishonest, like say, what what you're what you're saying is that asking for for like someone else to just drop the scan when you when ever like when he already knows it exists and already knows where to find it you're say, you're you're claiming that it's dishonest that's what surprises me and that's very idiotic. All right, so well, let's let's go through this analogy since we're all dropping somewhat uh, analogies even though some of them are false equivalents. So let's say nine are debating about something. And I know something exists. I know I know a scan exists, but I can't find it. Like I just can't find it, right? And this is the scenario that's, because that's, that's, until he posted it, he did not have it. Yeah, if I say, hey, ho hold on. Yeah, if I say, that, that, wait one second, one second. That, that's Sorry. right. That's right. But okay. someone else. And then if has I say, Hashi, can you give me this scan so I can prove my point, right? In a one v one debate, if you're helping someone prove their point and you're not a part of the debate, that is dishonest. But wasn't no, the whole because you the can't whole prove point. the point. Hold on, you cannot yeah. prove the point you brought up. You need someone else to supplement your evidence for you. No, that is dishonest. Know, so when you say just you because it doesn't matter it. if you know it exists, no, that has no, nothing no, to do with an argument. What we mean by you know it exists? No, we have to go over this. That has this. nothing to do with so, an argument. If no, you're doing a one-to-one yeah, -one argument, oh no, yeah, it does. Because if I say, if I say, for instance, um, uh. Again, like this Superman feed exists, right? And I like let's say it was on Comic Vine and I found it a while ago and then Comic Vine got yeeted into oblivion. And like I just vaguely know it's from like Superman issue one hundred, but I don't have that issue, but Naya has it. He can give me that scan because I can vividly describe it and I know that and, and that's outside help. Kappa, why are we going over this when it didn't happen in our debate? 
Because well, Naya keeps Naya brought it up, so we're going on it. No, it's, it's seems... because Cap, it's. I'm just saying that Cap is saying that it's dishonest when the opposite is dishonest. Like the opposite isn't dishonest. Are, so you're saying Hitch and Fraser say... isn't a valid argument? No, he 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 can't. Okay. He can't. He can't. For the audience. Hey, no, hold Naya on. says the Hitch and Fraser is not an argument. That's not what I said. He just he said, yes, that's not what said, I said. That's said, not what I said. I, I said, I said I is Hitch and Fraser not an argument? You said no. I literally. No, I literally said no in the context of that's not what I'm saying. And then I went on to explain what I was saying, Kappa. You understand that, Kappa? Do you hear me? I hear you, but that's okay. not what happened. That is, that, we'll okay. go on. We'll, what, we'll go along what with I it. Said is, okay, so, so you're saying that, that's not, that, um, that wasn't contextually what I was saying? No, because you paused and then said no, so we changed context. No, that's that's not what happened. I said I said no, and then I started explaining what I meant. So, do, do you want to do you want to go back on your claim? Do you want to stop being dishonest, Kappa? You want to stop being salty that you lost to Tay? Am I being dishonest? Yeah, you are. Uh, well, demonstrably, I don't think so, because the first thing that people can help each other in Demonstrably, you're being dishonest as fuck. Yeah. And yeah, I'm not saying that people can help each other in debates. Like, you know, okay, we're not helping him make arguments. We're just hel helping him grab evidence to save time. It helps everyone. It helps you. It helps him. It helps the audience. It helps Ooh. the judges. Like, uh, I thought the whole point was that Tay already knew where the scans were. It's just, it was just. This didn't happen. Our, in he, our he, knows what just he knows what. He knows what. He, like, okay, Tay, Tay, the, the, the debate's irrelevant. I'm just saying that he's uh, saying yeah. that it is dishonest, right? And I'm telling him that that that's that trying to force someone, like trying to force someone into the position that he forced you into, is dishonest. And so. But so you're only claiming it's dishonest, but you're not demonstrating how it's dishonest. No, I did. You're only saying that, oh, we're just trying to save time. But that has nothing to do with the principle of what I said. You're not addressing the principle. You're beating around the bush. Okay. Well, what's the principle that you said, Cal? The principle is, if you come to a 1v1 debate, which we clearly outlined, I went through of even titling the debate for everyone, and then... You know, I gave the premise that, hey, um, it might take me a second to get scans. He accepted. He himself didn't say, I need to grab calcs, right? I had e We had everything ready to go. He had over a week to prepare. He comes to a debate and then says, I don't have the calcs. Can someone give me the calcs or give me the scans? Instead he of said, saying, I don't have I, he said, I, he I said, No, that's not what he said. That's not what he said, Cap. He said, I don't have it on hand. Can someone grab Which it you mean so I don't have to look for it? He said, no, he said, can someone grab it so I don't have to look for it? That's not, it's not not having it. It's not having it on hand. Not having it on hand is not having it for debate. That's not, no, that's not. That's not, Kappa. That's like, hold on. Not, it would be the same not, thing not, as not, me on, opening no, up not, my Kappa, desktop. Kappa, Kappa, Kappa. Not Raising having it on hand. saying it's not isn't Kappa, an argument. Kappa, not, not having it on hand is not the same as not having it for the debate. It's, 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 it's the equivalent of not having it at the moment and then having to go waste time looking for it because you do have it. You just have to look for it, Kappa. Like, so, so he, can, he does have it. He can prove his point. He's describing where he would have to go get it as well. Like, you're just being an actual idiot. Do you not understand the concept, Kappa? No, again, you're going around the principle, right? No, I'm not. not, I've, already not addressed, I've, already principle. Addressed, I've already addressed your principle. Because you're saying that he's requiring help to prove his point. He's not requiring help to prove his point. He's requiring help to speed up the debate. Which would still be he's, proving point because he doesn't have the scan ready. Okay, he can prove his point, Kappa. So he's only not requiring because help to do it. At the time, he would only be able to prove his point by someone else giving him the scan. Okay, and then later, th later on throughout the debate, after, an, after like 30 or so minutes of time has been wasted, he can prove his point. Because he got it, and that's perfectly fine. There was no time limit on the he, debate. And he, can, and he can then, and he can then as well, right? He just has to um he just has to go look for it and then you both sit there for 30 minutes. But we didn't sit there for 30 minutes. We went on to additional points while he found it. And then he found it and he posted it and that's fine. The problem is you can't ask for outside help and expect hey, me Kappa. not to say that's dishonest. Okay, so no.
What are you talking about? Okay, are you equivocating a, a, a pretty much semi-informal debate into a mean debate? Are you are you going to present that as are you going to present that to me? It was a mean debate. <laughs> I don't know why I mean debate would change like the principles of debate. Yeah. Because first of all, we both agreed to move on while he found the point, right? I said, let's move on. He said, okay, we agreed to move on. We just didn't arbitrarily move on while the other person is waiting for the evidence. Okay. That did happen. Then I said, hey, do you want to go ahead and move on while we, you know, while we look for something? He said, yes, every time. Okay. And then he also asked me if we can move on from stuff. And I said, yes. We asked permission first. That means it can't be dishonest. I told you exactly. Hey, while I look for this, I'm going to move on to different points. So we can yeah, but you did Hold on. But you didn't ask me, did you? You just said, hey, I'm going to look. I'm, I'm going to move on while I'm looking for this. And I said, no, you can't do that. That would be dishonest because you didn't ask me. Those are demonstrably. Those, that's a false equivocation. Those aren't no, the same thing at all. You didn't say any of that. All you did was you're dishonest. Because I was, because um, I said something, I was trying okay. to get, uh, Yeah, to so I never you throw around claims without dishonest. substantiating them first, so that's that's wrong. Okay. I don't I, I don't do that. Demonstrably, I don't. And I was explaining to you, and I was going to grab it for you, and I said, because I didn't want to waste our time. Then you called me dishonest for that. Yeah. But, when Tate but we, we, we just established so the scenario we, giving the scenario doesn't seem likely, scenario. because, because I always I always explain in, in the argument what remember. I'm saying. You're, you're the only difference you gave between the two scenarios is that Tay asked, right? So, so are you are you insinuating that Tay asked to be dishonest? This what the principle of whether or not that would be a straw man. No one said that at all. Tay asked, okay. asked permission, said, "Hey, while we're, or I even asked or he asked, we both get, said, "Hey, do you want to go ahead and move on while you're looking for that?" Right? We're letting okay, the other. So, so, can you tell me what makes one dishonest and the other not? Can you? Okay, wh why does why does permission like? Why does permission entail honesty? Because you're not trying to shotgun, right? If you're trying to move on from points and then just bring up a whole bunch of points at once, okay. and you're trying to so, overwhelm so, your opponent, that's that's not a very honest way of debating, correct? Okay, so can, can you, like, demonstrate that he was even shotgunning when he only made one point at the time, and he was just going to prove it and then go on to another Wait, point? For um, Izzy? Yeah. Because Izzy brought up five or six points. He brought up... Um, Everyone masturbates. He brought up, if you don't masturbate, you're more likely to have a wedge. Hold on. Hold on. No, 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 no. Nate, he specifically asked me. He specifically... Hold on. So he asked me if I masturbate. I said no. And then he said, well, statistically, this happens, right? I, I'm not going to go over the details because that's we're going okay. with the foundation. So he, was, then he so brought he up three other all, points. So, so now you're lying because he wasn't making all those points at the same time. He was. They were all addressed. No, no, he wasn't. They were all addressed. He was. He brought he them up. Have, he brought them he up. Could not, he could not have been simultaneously making the point that you masturbate yes, in the alternative. No, he can't. He no, did. He can't. Yeah, no, no, he, he did. didn't. He didn't. No, hold he on. Didn't. I'll okay. tell you the order he did it, and Tay will agree. So, okay. no, Tay asked no, me, hold on. No, 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 no. Tay asked me one time, do you masturbate? I said no. And then Tay went on to list five different statistics, and I said, Tay, can you prove that? Right? He shotgunned me, and then said, well, I'm going to go look for one scan of one of these, and then not address the other four. No, I that's exactly what happened. No, 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 I was arguing the one thing until you asked for that. I'm like, this, okay, let me grab this. Uh, and then what did you say? Again. Then I said it's eight percent. You have eight percent chance of hold um hold uh, having wedge and if you don't masturbate, it's even higher. So you brought up additional claims, did you no, not, no. while you were looking? Okay, yes or no? No. Okay, while I was looking, I also it's a yes said or no right question. Before, I'm going to um, we're, okay, I'm going to uh, bring another point up while I look for this. So no, you didn't. You just brought up those points. That's what I did, Kappa. You didn't. Yes, that's what I did. You definitely did not. Kappa, why wouldn't I do that? Because I wouldn't have. I wouldn't have let it happen. I would have told you no. Find the scan, then we'll move on. Exhibited. You probably said no, and I accidentally ignored it at best. Like if I want to still man you, but in the end, I still asked, and that doesn't change what Tay did and what I did. So either way, how is Tay not dishonest, and how am I dishonest for that? What you did was fundamentally different because you didn't ask. Because if you did, I would have typed out no, right? I would have let you just bring up a bunch of points while looking for another point. I wouldn't have let that happen. But in an informal debate, 
where I know he has to look for stuff because we kind of went over this, that's fine. But if he says I need to look for it, he can have an unlimited amount of time because I asked for the same in the beginning. But it's not okay for him to ask other people. That's the difference. That's the fundamental difference between what happened. Because I was okay with him posting the calcs, even though it took him a different amount of time. Who cares how long it takes? There's no time limit on this. We didn't agree to, to like, 5, 5, 30, 30, 10, 10 conclusions, like a formal debate would be. It was an unlimited amount of time, because I know, I don't know if he's on the phone, because he mentioned his computer, so I assume he has better access than I do. And then the fact of the matter was that he asked for someone else to provide the scan, which, I, since I've been in here for almost two years, that has always been my position, in that I don't allow outside help like that, unless it's, unless beforehand... Right, because we've done this beforehand when I've been judge in uh, the past debates. I'm sure Hashi remembers this. He might not. But people have asked, can we provide scans for people if they're struggling to get it pulled up because of technical difficulties or just slow computer? That's been fine. The precursor, it's fine. But the fact that in mid-debate, no warning, hey, can someone drop the scan for me? No, that's not okay. Because it wasn't predetermined in the debate beforehand. That's the problem. That's the fundamental problem I had. Um, I'm saying that I do remember yelling at people for the exact same thing, though, because again, I've been doing it the whole time. But we have had debates where people have said, "Hey, we're going to offer. We have all the scans ready. You know, we know both the verses. If someone needs help with scans, we can drop them. That's fine, because I, it's been a while in the past. But that's not what that's not what this case was, and that's the problem I had. And I thought that was. That, I think that's more than. Okay to call out for I may have been overboard by saying dishonest because I do use that word a lot. However, it still is not something that's okay to do in a debate without it, without agreeing upon it beforehand if we're doing something like a, why, an actual semi formal okay, debate. Kappa? Because what, it, what the it potential still, but, so the potential okay. there is that you're dropping scans for someone that actually doesn't have them. I could just say, Well, I don't have the scan and I know I don't have the scan and I can't find it right. And then someone could drop the scan yeah. and that proves my argument, which is what it would do. I don't know. Yeah, I, I can't. All right, so I can't demonstrate that he actually it. knows everything about it. No, but the problem you get there, right, is that didn't happen. You can say, "Oh, it's a slippery slope, whatever." But I don't like. We we can cross that bridge when we come to it. I don't really care. What it gets down to is that Tay did it, and you had a problem with it when what Tay did was fine, because he literally had the calc, he got it and posted it. Yeah, just him while. having it and then posting it's fine. But asking for outside help to post it took him a while. We're trying to save time for everyone, as Nye explained earlier, and you had no problem yeah. with. D Tay also did. But like, the time was not factor in the Tay debate, also so. did like talk about like where one would find the scan. He said he said it was the Calicon versus battles that was done by Barrett, and like, and anyone could find it like that. It would just take him a while. If you knew where it was, then how would it take him a while? You just, that was kind of a contradictory statement. Because he's on, like, he's probably on, like, shuffling through several devices. When Tay debates, he's, um, he's got, like, two phones and a computer that he just, like, has different scans on. It's probably not a good okay. way to debate, but, but that's how Tay if it's on a, If it's on a website, that's not an argument, then. If it's on, if it's right. on a website, that's not an argument. He might be looking for scans for, for this other point that you're trying to make him address on his phone, which could be slower than, like, his computer, you know? Um, we kept it to singular points because, if you do remember, he did try to bring up more than one point, and then I said, hey, can you stop? We're going to go through this one point at a time. I did that two times in the debate. At one point, you asked him for, like, scans on, on, like, scans from, like, literally everything. Yeah, because yeah. he started doing like, that to me, and I said, well, then I need scans for everything, right? It, it was rhetoric. It wasn't an actual point. That, that, was, that, was, around, that, that, that was around that time, yeah, that he did that. You're like, I need scans for everything you said, and I need calcs for everything that you mentioned. And that's around that time where he where he said that. You know, and then and then um he he was also trying to look for that, um that one Rykage calc, so... So he was looking for two different calcs at the same time. Okay. And he ended up but like you said, him. hold on, but like you said, he knew exactly where it was, right? Yeah. And if he has yeah. multiple devices, he can multitask with those devices, correct? Okay, that's not how that works. <laughs> that's not how that works. Because you got to look on one device. You can, no, you can be signed in to multiple discords um, through two different devices on the same discord. Yeah, but you got to look through one device, Kappa. Yeah, if it's on a website, you don't have to look through a device. What do you mean? No, he has to read through your scans, and he also has to be listening to what you say. 
if he's looking like for that. a point, we stopped yeah, you, from, because no I wasn't providing scans. He said he needed to find the calc. Yeah, and then he, you also like he said, all right, we can move on while we do this. We've talked about this earlier. So he's like okay, having then. to listen to you okay. intensely. It's <sighs> not hearing because I can hear you while I'm doing anything. I I can hear you while I'm like actually debating someone else or something. He has to listen to you while, more than likely, he's trying to find the calc faster than looking at VSP. I, I'd also like to mention that um, if he knows if he knows where the calc is just by saying, like, it's on Versus Battles on Parrot's, um, like, blogs, um, someone, someone that has the calc bookmarked or, ha or already has, like, the calc posted somewhere and could just grab it instantly would would be able to post it faster than Tay would um looking up like parents account and going and like searching through his blogs. So there's that as well. Also, um the search function versus battles is absolutely god awful. <laughs> yeah, you'd have to like you'd have to like know the uh the like hyperlink thing for like someone's for like message walls in general. And and or you just um have to like click on somebody's um name in which he'd have to find like a thread or something that parents commented on. So you'd either have to just like go to someone's message wall or, or like find a thread that parents messaged on, click on his name. Or or he'd have to or, or or he'd have to go to a message wall hyperlink and like type in parents' username at the end. And and then eventually he would be at his message wall and then click on blogs and then have to search through his blogs. Or someone can just like post the couch. I, I you can know, tell that already you, has it bookmarked. I can tell you from, uh, well, I guess we can call this a repeatable experiment. I've like reverse searched forty k quotes before, right? And like not like barely anything like useful will come up. It'll mostly like at best, let's say it's like a Reddit discussion about it. Meanwhile, if I go on versus battles, that same quote is on um Azzy's blog. And if I Google Azzy forty k quotes, it won't come up either. I have to like find a link to it on Versus Bells, which thank the Emperor, it's on the, like, feats on every single character. But still, you're, like, every Versus Bells is god-awful for finding stuff. Like, mm. Tay's pretty sure I just found his, um, page on the his, the link to the calc on the front page of Google. Hold on. I'm making sure this page loads. Why'd Ice die at me? Also, I'm banning Mo. Hope no one has a problem with that. Yeah, go ahead. So, so. All right. I think Ice just want to be undiffed and unmuted or unmuted or whatever. Ooh, who's yelling at who? I don't know. Horton hears domestic abuse, though. Yeah. And um, I'm not salty because I lost. I don't like being. Um, I think I was valid in what I said about. And I did recant the dishonest part, but I still think it's okay to do that. And I think it's a valid point. Why do you think it's okay to do what? To um not allow outside help during debates, even if it's just grabbing scans, unless it's agreed on beforehand. And so, it, but I already backtracked and said, "Is already backtracked and said, um, dishonest wasn't the right word." Yeah, all it is is just saving time. But if like, it's agreed on upon beforehand, that's fine. But like, even then, I already said that I have I've I haven't read the manga. I don't know any of these calcs. No, it's not the fact that you have to know it. It doesn't matter if you know it or not. It's the fact that they can vividly describe it, and the only thing that's changing is the retrieval time. So all he said was, um, it was a calc someone did, where he said he three times the speed of no, light. That doesn't mean it actually DSP. exists. So it was a he calc said the Raikage calc. Yeah, he said it's the Raikage calc on VSB that produces this result, and it's done by this person. Yeah, he did say the uh, number as well, like how many times that's the O. Yeah. He knows, like, literally everything important about the calc, and he probably even knows where to find the manga page. So, um, from now on, if we see characters dodging light, um, that's no longer based on FCL, right? Because I'm pretty sure, um, um Nye has already looked at the scans that I posted, and he agreed to do FTL. Okay. I mean, um, it wouldn't inherently be that way, but I do think those are, um, FTL. What you should have said, Kappa, is that the distance that they're moving in relation to the, um, the distance that the light moving is more in the same amount of time. I'm back, sorry. Well, I did, so during the debate, I don't know if you guys heard this because my connection's no. been kind of shoddy, but I did say that she ducked her whole body, right? Yeah, and then I, in I my conclusion, I brought up in the conclu in my conclusion, I brought the point up again. And in the conclusion, I brought up that um, the light was just no, interesting on her face and she ducked. No. Yeah, you... 
Um, that's I, I remember you saying that in your conclusion video whenever you were first um whenever you were first describing the feet. You just said yeah. that she saw it coming and she ducked. Yeah, that's all. But you, I did. I did say inches in my conclusion. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, yeah, you did say it then. I'm just saying that yeah. um, during the yeah, debate but, you didn't. Yeah. So and, then, yeah, it should be, it should I'd be like to ask point. the other two. Ju- the other. Um, I'd like to ask the other judge that said I didn't quantify it. Right. The fact that it's inches from her face mm-hmm. and she's able to duck her body. How is that not FTL? You said it was unquantified. By quantify, he mean quantify like in FTL, yeah. like how many times? Yeah, but I didn't. I just said baseline. I said baseline multiple yeah. times. That's unquantifiably FTL. No, it's. I said baseline. It doesn't yeah, have to be baseline. quantifiable if I'm just playing baseline. Yeah, but if Tay gave me that, right? And the other saw. I didn't panel you. No, he saw. But the other one. Yeah, but the yeah. Uh, you you didn't um you didn't even mention the um five thousand times right? You just said I had it unquantifiable the MFTL. Yeah. So when you, I say how do you justify that? When I say unquantifiable, I mean like uh by quantify, I mean like five times FTL, like baseline yeah, FTL. I still consider that unquantifiable. Even Nina heard us. The Tay gave the FTL um feet. Yeah, so I know. Baseline, one times FTL. Yeah, I said I and still then consider baseline unquantifiably FTL. How baseline literally means. One times faster than light, just like based on continental has a set value. Based on faster no, light has because, a set value. Because it's because you bring up characters who are unquantifiably faster than one times. Yeah, but none of those matter. Yeah, I was just showing. I was showing how they're relative to each other. I I even stated that they're all baseline FTL being relative to each other. Okay, and take I mean, and take accepted I feel, that. No, I was bringing. Okay, I understand you have these people at baseline FTL, and then you bring up people who are like. Unquantifiably faster than them, so the end result is unquantifiably. Yeah. I'm not saying no, like you didn't have a problem this one girl specifically is unquantifiable. You're reverting to the fact that they're all unquantifiable when you just accepted they're not unquantifiable. I, I'm saying this pink girl uh, for that baseline FTL. Yeah, she's baseline. Yeah, she's baseline. Yeah, they're all the relative to each other. Unquantifiably faster than her are unquantifiably. No, I said I claim they were all relative in baseline. The only unquantifiable so one want them lower than was the villain. I'm, I'm confused. The only one that wasn't baseline. Was the villain right? The one with the eight arms that completely blitz or are you trying to say that all my was faster than the villain? Hold on, but then see, I, I don't think you listened to the whole debate. Then see, if we have, we need to screen people for judging, which this isn't relevant. I'm, you all 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 my dog I'm trying to help you. I'm trying to help you. So when I brought Can up the cow, right? I showed that. So I showed how the guy's cork worked. Right? He's able to move so fast that other people stand still. He performs an on um, policeman. Um, which are arguably fashion light, but I didn't I didn't push that point because I'm not gonna sit here and open up the manga again. But then he does the same exact thing to the villain. Okay. Twice. I posted multiple scans of him doing it. He did it twice to the villain. Okay. So if, if so you didn't have a problem with the snail speed um multiplication. So that would be at least five thousand times faster than light. You didn't have a problem with that. No, I, I didn't accept that in my judging. That's why I determined Tay one because I literally didn't accept that. But I've already so you not, hold on, but you not accepting it. Gave you the speed. He still couldn't ever damage Sasuke. I already explained why he's doing it. Hey, to avoid getting back into a meta debate, right? Because those are well, the problem is, what, no, wait, but I, so the I, problem I really is Hashi. He, no, he said agree. he didn't accept it, but didn't give a reason. He just accepted it because he didn't accept it. That's not okay. Mm-hmm. No, I, I did I, give a reason I, in my oh, judgment. Josh, I shut up for five seconds. All right. Well, I'll take any like uh, opportunity to call Jaja a retard because that's always funny, and I do agree we, you should screen judges. We've had a couple instances of people just picking judges, and that doesn't end up too well. And you can have your qualms with uh, Jaja. That's fine. I'm just saying I'm trying to avoid Tay coming back in and us having another debate. Yeah. But I, but I, okay, but it's just because you guys keep bringing this up. Okay, Cap, let me matter. still man you and give you the speed. You st- yeah. you still don't win because he still could never damage. So Jaja, do you know what happens when I say the debate doesn't matter are anymore? Are you harping on why the do you, speed? Why do you keep harping on it? You are harping on the speed as well as it doesn't change the outcome. I'm addressing his ability to judge, which is what my premise was. Hey, okay, from what you okay, I'm telling you, I didn't accept that uh, the snail speed scaling. I was like listening to Tate's t- refute to it, and like so, since I didn't accept this uh, the snail pace scaling, from my understanding. You scaled this pink-haired girl to like baseline FTL, and you scaled all oh, my unquantifiably faster than her because the methods of quantifying it 
I didn't accept it, and I accepted Taser of Feet more. I think this proves that he didn't listen to the, this part of the debate. I Because I never mentioned All Might with her. But wait, all Might would have to be faster. How, like, all Might would scale but I didn't scale to her, to her at all. I, do know. I didn't mention that. Hey, that's, that's just you mentioned you didn't like listen. how All Might would scale two characters who are like unquantifiably faster. But you now you're changing your argument to other people. What? But you did, though, because All Might would have to scale above them so he could have to be that fast. So you did, whether you indirectly did it or not. Like, regardless, he would have to scale above her to be that fast. Well, why are you making arguments for people you're not a part of the conversation of? Because, because you're, being, you're being dishonest. Because that you didn't... I'm you just dishonest? You didn't, yeah, you just uh, said he, you didn't scale All Might above Mina when you did. You have to. That's not what I said. I didn't scale him too much. Right, but, he, but you did never did. Hey, you did. You yeah. did no, have to scale her above. You did scale him above. Yeah, but above and two aren't the same thing. Those you, are completely hey, different words. Regardless, that's what this that's isn't the point semantic. Those you are fundamentally different above. words. Okay, you know what I mean, Kappa. You're scaling all might above this girl who's a baseline FTL. Yeah. So that would be like unquantifiably fast. Well, I've already explained why you don't have to be inherently five thousand times faster than somebody in that right. count. I don't know uh, where that's coming from. I'm a bit but your, your that argument there didn't hold, but it's okay. Wait, so I'm a bit confused on Jaja, why are you mad? Cap is saying that faster, or well, he doesn't have the calc for that beat, but because he's moving so much, it would have to be FTL. But he's going to lowball it to baseline because he doesn't have a calc. And then he's assuming that all these people who are faster, right, are also baseline because you can't quantify it. That's the last quantifiable value he has. So what's the okay. problem with them, Jaja? He doesn't have a problem. He had a problem with the I, five I, I, I didn't. I didn't have a. I didn't have a problem if he just says they're baseline. I'm yeah, no. He, like he had no. He had the problem with me saying it was unquantifiable. I don't explain my reason on why it's unquantifiable. Yeah. You was asking. You were no, asking. Me I that? said, "What is your problem with the calc?" What is? Oh, you. We were just dwelling on the unquantifiable point. Now we're talking about the no, like, because you, you said all, you said the calc was unquantifiable, and I would ask you what what do you no, mean? No, I didn't say the calc was unquantifiable. I said I accepted Taze refute more, so I came okay. to the conclusion that was unquantifiable. Hey, so, let's break down what Taze said. So Taze said even if you're just two times faster than someone, you can outspeed them. Correct? 